New York. <laughs> I'm back. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. City of big dreams and I'm just. New York, <laughs> I'm back. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. City of big dreams and I'm just this up. They get top three picks and I'm just this up. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. City of big dreams and I'm just this up. They get top three picks and I'm just this up. And even when we die, and I'm still up. <laughs> I had to take a break, was on a hiatus My team been doing bad, but they still my favorite When I'm Jets on the schedule in the five plate Five fingers to your face, I'm like, hi, hater Hey, that's my squad, they been missing me DWA, we stick together through the misery When I pray go down to New York, do you remember me? The one that love to spell your name and always dish your team J-E-T-S, suck, suck, suck F-I-N-S, uh, uh, uh when we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet met like your fans, hush, hush, hush. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, uh, uh, uh. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet met like your fans, hush, hush, hush. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. City of big dreams and I'm just this up. They get top three picks and I'm just this up. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. City of big dreams and I'm just this up. They get top three picks. And the best still up, and even when we die, and the best still up. So low, D. New York. Johnson, CEO at TPP, the Positive Corpus. 
I'm Jason Miller from Fins Up SoCal Fan Club. I'm Scott Howell from Atlanta Dolphin Club. Mark Angelo, NorCal Dolphin Club. And you're listening to Clock Blockers, Miami Fans' number one morning show. <clears throat> What's up, ladies and gentlemen? It is your boy, Stephen D, and it is Spread Kindness Fridays. Super excited. It's Jet Suck Weekend. I haven't even packed my bags yet. True story. Actually, my bags are almost like halfway still packed from the Miami trip that I came in this past weekend because I was there forever. Yeah. So in a couple of hours, I will be heading up. I-95 to New York. I am super excited about hanging out with y'all this morning. We're going to have a fun show this morning. We are going to have a fun show this morning. A fun show. Because we're going to talk about how the Jet Sox. I know y'all liked that song. If y'all like that song, y'all better hit that like button right now. If y'all like that new solo D hit, boy, you better hit that like button. I'm not playing with y'all. That was fire. That was fire. Yes, I'm going to see the game live. I'm going to be there three weeks in a row. I was there for the Houston game. We won that. I was there for the Baltimore game. We won that. And you know what? I'm going to be there for this Jets game. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to win that too. I'm going to sprinkle a little dust on them. Spring a little dust, say, all right, hey, look, boys, I can't be here for the next few weeks. So y'all need to realize that I that Big Daddy Steve can't just be here every game. So I'm going to spring a little dust on them, make sure that they're all good and ready to go after this Jets game, and then they're going to take over the world. They're going to take over the world. My man Roman Reigns is in the building. My man Roman Reigns is in the building. Boy, boy, y'all ain't got no idea. I'm happy today, boy. Y'all know why I'm happy? Because my wife's happy. Because I'm about to go up to New York. Because Miami Sports Music Podcast Network's the number one podcast network in South Florida. Let's go hit that like button if you agree. Hit that like button if you agree. I don't think y'all are ready for Spread Kindness Fridays. I don't think y'all are ready for this extravagant show that I have for y'all today. Y'all ain't ready for it. Uh, maybe I should just, maybe I should just, you know, say, hey, you know, it's been a good show. We'll see y'all on Monday for Victory Monday, by the way. Y'all ain't ready for today. Y'all ain't in the inbox just going crazy. I need y'all to go crazy right now. I need y'all to go crazy. I need y'all to just, just get ready. Oh man, I'm super excited about it. Let's go. Um, look. Like button smashed, Anthony says. My man Jaconda's in the building. Jaconda, yo, true story, guys. Jaconda and I literally live like an hour away from each other. Less than. We live less than an hour away from each other. And the first time we ever saw each other at a game, true story, was this year, bro. Was this year. At, in Miami. In Miami. So, shout out to Jaconda. That's my boy. He's coming up to New York. We're going to hang out in New York. Why do we got to, yo, why do we got to go to other states, Jaconda, to hang out? It makes no sense to me. We need to get together over these next few weeks. You and I, I'm just saying. Uh, Bite the mic, Steven, if you want to keep winning. Bite the mic. I hope. There we go. Better be a good donation to that. Speak something. Pastor Steve, we out here today with my boys, the Dolphins. And we're going to get this W. Can I get an amen in the building? Let me get an amen if you think we're going to get this W. Huh? Huh? D Cope, let's go. I think that's I think that's solo. I think that's solo. I think that's solo. Pretty boys in the building, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Yo, I'm, I'm excited, boy. Y'all don't even know. I'm so excited. If you think that the Dolphins are going to just beat down the Jets. And there's going to be a no-fly zone at the Meadowlands this weekend. Let me get a hallelujah. Let me get a hallelujah. Oh, look at Big Drip. Look at Big Drip. This is me, Jaconda, Steven. I I thought it was. I thought it was. 
Jaconda over here. You hitting that like button five different ways this Sunday. I like it. Hey, I don't care if you got 15 accounts. Hit that like button for 15 accounts. If you guys haven't done so already, hit that like button. Let people know what we about to do. About to take over that song. Y'all, y'all want it. Y'all want to hear that song. Look, I ain't even got started on the stuff yet. All right, hold on. All right, let me play the song. I'll play the song one more time for y'all. Because y'all obviously like the song. Y'all liked the song. Here, let me do this. Here we go. Got it. Here we go. If y'all can hear it, put it in the chat. I'll, I'll play it one more time. This is this is that new Solo D song. <laughs> Jet still suck. I'm back. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm Jet still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm Jet still suck. They get top three picks and I'm Jet still suck. And even when we die, and the up. still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm Jet still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm Jet still suck. They get top three picks and I'm Jet still suck. And even when we die, and the up. still up. <laughs> I had to take a break, was on a high eight. My team been doing bad, but they still my favorite. When I'm Jets on the schedule, then the foul's late. Five fingers to your face, I'm like, hi, hey. Hey, plus my squad, they been missing me. DWA, we stick together through the misery. When I pray, go back to New York, do you remember me? The one that loved us, spell your name and always this your team. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, up, up, up. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, 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 rush. And when we yet, man, like your fans, hush, hush, hush. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, up, up, up. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet, man, like your fans, hush, hush, hush. Hey, I been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up, big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Hey, I done been around the world. And I'm just still suck. Sit up, big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Jets up. Jets up. Jets up. Fins up. Fins up. Jets up. Jets up. Fins up. Fins up. We like J E T E. Suck, suck, suck. F I N S. They like J E T S. Suck, suck, suck. F I N S. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Who that? So low, so low, so low, D. So low, so ah, low, boy. so low, D. He does it. New York. Whew. Wah, 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 wah. I had to do it. I had to do it. Oh, boy. y'all, We out here. We out here. Yeah, man. If only we didn't suck. Bro, we, we don't suck, bro. We about to go on this three-game win streak. Oh. It's time for the percolator. It's time for ooh. It's, uh, see, Big Drip, you get me going, boy. Bob Young said, J-E-T-S, suck, suck, suck. Hey, guys, if y'all like that song, donate to the channel. Hit that like button. Let's go. Let's have a great show lined up for y'all today. Hey, um, I never did the housekeeping this morning because y'all got me hyped this morning. Y'all got me hyped. If you guys want to sign up, become a member. Sign up, become a member. Be like my man A Dolphins Grizzlies or Big Drip ENT or Trucker Sean or one, two, three, four Eps. Come on, let's go. Let's go. D Cup says we're gonna win out. We're gonna win out. We are gonna win out. I love it. I love it. Hey guys, sign up, become a member today. I want to see you become part of the family. I, that's my Vin Diesel voice from Fast and the Furious. Family. Guys, I want to see y'all come out. We're going to have a good time. My man, become part of the family. There's three different levels. You guys can become part of any level you want. If you guys want to uh, donate to the channel, help the channel grow, there's three different ways to do it. 
Use the YouTube live super chat, which is the dollar sign down at the bottom of the chat. You can also use PayPal, which is MSM Podcast Network, or you can use Cash App, which is dollar sign MSM Podcast Network. And let me tell you all something. If you all donate $25, $25, just put it in the jaw, 25 I got a raffle going on. Right now, there's six out of 50 slots filled. Six out of 50 slots filled. That means there's 44 more slots to fill up. I'm going to fill up these slots before we do anything, just to let you all know. What can you all win? Or well, first thing you all can win is this autograph Frank Gore jersey. That's right. JSA certified Frank Gore jersey goes to the first place in the raffle. If you donate $25, every $25 is one entry. Okay? First place is Frank Gore autograph jersey, JSA certified, courtesy of Simbad Sports and Fan Club Weekend. Second place gets a really cool prize, too. Second place gets, that's right. Autograph Ricky Williams, JSA certified as well. Okay? So look, man, I got a lot of stuff here. And I'm even going to do a last place, lucky loser prize. So it'll be three good prizes handed out. And maybe I'll even send some random people stuff here and there, some stickers and stuff. I got a whole bunch of stuff from uh, Fan Club Weekend. So, guys, donate to the channel. It helps the channel grow. But a portion of all the $25 donations... A portion of all those donations we're going to send to the Dolphins Cancer Challenge. Uh, on behalf of TPP, yeah, you know me, the positive porpoise. So let's go, man. Let's donate to a good cause. Let's raise some money. And ho let's get you a great prize that you need in your man cave or woman cave, whatever one it is. Uh, yeah. Yeah, man. All right, let's go. Um, I appreciate y'all doing that. All right, hey, I want to give a big shout out to our sponsor, Tail Greener. Tail Greeter is absolutely amazing. Let me tell you all a little bit about Tail Greeter. Go to tailgreeter.com or download the app today and look up this weekend's event. That's right. Tail Greeter is a part of the MetLife Takeover now, officially. Okay? So if y'all want to come hang out at the Tail, the tail Greeter pregame show that is live on Sunday right here on the Miami Sports Music Podcast Network from 10 a.m. to noon, guys, go there if you can't be there. Okay, and if you can be there, go to tailgreeter.com or download the app and put in MetLife Takeover, MetLife Takeover, okay, and you guys can find uh, the event for this weekend, they have a lot of cool stuff, and uh, yeah, I want you all to have a good time. Spread Kindness Friday, it's contagious, baby. Guys, I'm getting these shirts made up. I'm going to have these shirts made up in a couple of weeks for y'all. It's going to be a lot of fun. I got to send this stuff over to Cam and Dirty Sportswear, but yeah, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. Hey, man, I'm, I, I don't know why. I'm just, I'm so excited for today, man. I am so excited for today. Um, let's see here. Jimmy Bones says Falcons could have won that stupid game mistakes. Falcons didn't even score a point last night. I don't even want to talk about that stupid game. I didn't even watch, but like five, I, I started out, I'm like, I'm, I'm going to wait till halftime. Thir beginning of the third quarter shows up. I'm like, nah, nope, not watching this. Not watching this. Patriots are beating some scrub teams. I said it. Patriots are beating some scrub teams. I know Atlanta beat us. I get that. I understand that. But come on, yo. Atlanta ain't all that. We were on a losing streak. We don't know what was going on. We're going to take those seven games that we lost in a row and erase them from our memory break. They ain't never happened this year. As far as I'm concerned, we're going to be 10-0 this year. 10-0. Okay? Um, that's all right. That is okay. Uh, hey, look, man. What, what's going on? Y'all want to come out? Uh, hey, uh, Trucker Sean with the $5 donation. Jet suck, 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 and that song is fire. That song is fire. Solo D did his thing. $5 from Shake Money. Did you know Ross wanted to buy the Jets first? I did not. I know he's from New York, though. I do know that he's from New York. Uh, we are not the same team back then that we are now. Yo, Jaconda, we're going to get this dub, man. Don't even worry about it. We're going to be 3-0 and after this weekend. They praised Mac Jones, and he had the same numbers as Tua. Hey, we don't call Justo. Justo. We don't call him Mac Jones on here, okay? We call him Whack Jones. Who? Whack Jones. 
281-330-8004. Phone. Hit Whack Jones up on the low. Yeah, he's whack. We don't we, we on this channel we call him Whack Jones. Okay? And that's how he'll always be. I don't care what he does. Uh let's see here. Whack. Whack Jones. Oh man. Just to say, I got you, bro. Uh all right. Hey. Big game this weekend, guys. It's Spread Kindness Friday. Y'all want to come up here? Y'all want to hang out with your boy, Stephen D? Hit that like button. Donate to the channel. Let's go. And uh, hey, here's here's the chat. I put it in the chat. Why don't y'all come on? Watch y'all hang out. Let's talk. Let's hang out. Let's have some fun. It's Spread Kindness Friday. And um, yeah. Why don't y'all tell me about something kind you're going to do this weekend? That You know what? In order to come on the panel today, you have to tell me something kind you're going to do this weekend. That's what I want to hear from you. What is something kind you are going to do for somebody else this weekend? Okay. I put the link in the chat. You guys come on, hang out with me. Hey, hey, Jaconda, why don't you come on for like a couple of minutes? I know you're probably working, cuz, but come on. Tell me about this weekend. She got coming up. Let's see here. My man, my man is in the building. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yo, yo, yo. What's going on? I like that old school. Uh, Dolphins logo hat. That's that's. Oh, my, you like that? Well, that's my yeah, favorite. It's, it's, it's a little cold out here today. It's a little cold. Where are you at? North Carolina. Oh, North Carolina! Come on and raise up. Take yeah. your, don't take your shirt off, Epps. Don't take your shirt off. But I can yeah. do it. No, bro, we good. We good, man. Right. We this ain't that type of party. All right. You know what um, I'm saying? Hey. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, Steven, uh, I wanted to get on you, man. Speaking of Solo D, I was listening to some of his old tracks. The Dolphin Commandments, you broke number five, bro, talking about Nick Saban. That's all I'm saying. Oh, did you just call me out? I just called you out, bro. You broke the fifth Dolphin Commandment. Bro. By Solo D, you brought up Nick Saban. You know better. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But even God says that we can forgive. So, oh, we so forgive. We forgive. We're going to forgive. We're going to forgive. We gonna forgive. That's what we're going to do. We're going to forgive. I don't want to break no tent. Dolphin Commandments. That is a hot song, though, right? That song is so hot, man. And I was listening to some of his old stuff, and I was like, man, this song is fire. And then while I was listening to it, I was like, Stephen. Stephen done broke one of these commandments. This is the fifth commandment. <laughs> I, I like how so, you called me out on that. I, I hope Solo's tweeted, watching, because Solo's going to get on me about that. I oh, almost I tweeted, it. but I was like, no, nah, I'm going to save it for the show. I'm going to save it for the show. I'm going to spread kindness to Stephen. What are you going to do this week yeah, to spread I'm, I'm kindness to somebody? Uh, you know, I, you got to think I, of I what? To you don't have to answer that. Think about it for a minute. Think about it for a minute. Let me think about it. Let uh, me think about it. Because I always try to be kind to people that are kind to me. Respect is given and respect is taken. You know what I mean? So, hey, by the way, so there was, uh, I want to share this with you all. So let me share the screen real quick. Um, so there uh, was this post on social media uh, from a reporter down in South Florida. Uh, and it's about this um, kid who lives in Seattle, who's a big Dolphins fan. So I want to share this with you guys because it's pretty dope, actually. So I'm going to go ahead and play it and you guys watch it. And um, I would recommend that you guys get a box of tissues because you're going to cry. Because I'm not saying I was crying. I'm just saying I had something in my eyes at the end of this video, okay? <laughs> All right. All right, here we go. I'm going to play it. I'm not saying I was crying, but I might have been crying, bro, because, bro, it was... Uh, you got allergies, bro. <laughs> I got allergies, man. My oh. video, it was. It, you know why it hit home? 
You know why that, that, that hit home? Because I was that kid in North Carolina, right? Like, I was that kid growing up that, like, nobody liked the Dolphins. Like, my parent, my dad liked, like, I wouldn't be a Dolphins fan without my dad. Don't get me wrong. But he didn't like football like that. So, like, I was literally the only Dolphins fan within 100 million miles, right? And at least that's what it felt like. Right. And I, I could just imagine what that kid, like, that kid being in Seattle Seattle Seahawks territory. And by the yeah. way, they got fire jerseys, bro. It's not like their stuff Oh, their is jerseys right. are fire. Right? So, it's not like, it, it's. I don't know how he became a Dolphins fan, but let me tell you, that kid is awesome. That kid is straight awesome. Sometimes you don't become one, you're born one, man. That's what Spread Kindness Friday is all about right there. Like, when I saw that, I was like, I'm not crying. You're crying, man. I never felt like you and him because I was born in West Palm Beach, Florida. You know what I mean? 45 minutes from Miami. So, I lived there my whole life. I moved to North Carolina for my old lady's job. So, I never got to feel being in a different state, wearing, repping your colors until... I you know, came here. You know what's funny though, right? So like if you've never been to a Dolphins game in Miami, or you like if you've never been to South Florida, period, right? The best part about South Florida, and I was telling Solo this when we were here when I was hanging out with him when I was down there this past week, I was like, we were at a gas station getting something to drink. And I just saw like three people get out of their cars and they were all like one was wearing a dolphin's hat, one was wearing a dolphin's hoodie, one had a dolphin sticker on their car. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, I was like, this is awesome, man, because, like, if I ever see anybody around here that's wearing Dolphin stuff, I'm calling them out. Hey, bro, oh, what's yeah. up, man? You're a Dolphins fan? Awesome. Me, same too. Here, same and we here. can talk. But when you're in South Florida, they're, it's everywhere, bro. It's, it's, they it's represent in South Florida. They represent, man. Yeah, Everybody it's, it's represents in South Florida. Pete said, uh, with the $10 donation, uh, thank you, so, uh, thank you, Pete. Bro, Solo D, I love you, dude. I'm rocking Jets suck even if we lose. It's fins up for life, dude. That Tell All Solo day. D, man. I, tell Solo D that song is fire, man. He did it. He outdid himself, man. Well done, bro. Well hey, done. Man. He, he, look, man. Solo does does his thing, man. I'm going to share it everywhere I can, man. You know what I mean? Like, hard work needs to be recognized, man. And especially hard, good work, man. Alec Jeffrey said, bruh, I grew up in Miami. I'm in Seattle, and I'm still a Dolphins fan. Talk about a billion miles. There you go. Um, yeah. So, hey, look, guys, I put the uh, link to the panel and, and the click. Come on with me and one, two, three, four Eps. Come hang out. It's Spread Kindness Friday right here on the Miami Sports Music Podcast Network, the network made by a fan for you, the fans. On home of the number one Miami fan want to show clap blockers, it's your boy, Stephen D, doing the thing big. Uh, Black Dolphin said, I missed the song. Can we hear it? We can hear it. We 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 will hear it again in a little bit, Black Dolphin. You gotta you gotta chill. You gotta wait with me. I can't just be giving y'all the good stuff automatically for you know, y'all y'all gotta invest in and, and make a bunch of accounts on YouTube and just keep playing it, keep playing it when it comes on there. <laughs> just hit that like button, put it on repeat. Times. Oh man. Uh, let's see here. Do- uh, Kelvin Smith said, Dolphins fan here in Phoenix, Arizona, baby. I like it. I like it. God Soldier said, in South Florida, it's hard to find Dolphin fans. The stadium is always half Dolphins. Yo, but to us, God Soldier, to people that don't live in South Florida, when I come down to South Florida and see Dolphins license plates and Dolphins stickers on their car and, do- and people in a Dolphins. Yeah. Like we, so- Solo does uh uh, uh, real estate stuff and we're, we're at one of his complexes and um, some person just walked out wearing a do- like a kid like 13 year old kid just wearing a Dolphins hoodie and bro I wanted to cry bro I was like they're yeah, everywhere he, I love here it here it's all Carolina Panthers Cam Newton it's it uh, awesome like you said Stephen when you meet somebody with a Dolphins fan you're like what's up I know and then all of a sudden you guys are best friends could be a grocery store whatever it doesn't matter I mean, it, it's it's great, man. I, I whew. but when I saw that video, man, I got a little, I got a little, I I was I was cutting an onion when I was watching it. That's what was happening. I was yeah. cutting an onion. What was that kid's name, man? That he he's awesome, man. I don't know, but the kids from Spokane, Washington. That's awesome, man. Shout out to you, brother. Oh, Joey, Joey is his name. Joey, man. Shout out to you, Joey. Yeah, I, uh, it was it was awesome. All right, let me bring on this gentleman. Y'all know, y'all love him. He equals clicks. It Pete is Pete. in the building. What's up, Must Pete? Must be Pete. Must be Pete. 
Hey, what's going on, guys? Good morning to you guys. Spread Just kindness know, Friday, baby. Spread kindness Friday. Oh, this is my kindness for Friday. The Jets still suck. I'd have been Ooh. around the world, world and the, and the Jets, Jets still, still suck. suck. Ah, hey, Solo D, I love it, bro. Solo, I'd have heard it like three times driving. So Solo, Solo uh, sent me that song this morning, or sent me that song last night in an email, right? Uh, actually, yesterday he sent it to me. So I'm out and about, and I listened to the song, and I was like, oh, my God, this is fire. So I call him later in the day, and I was like, hey, bruh. He just picked up the phone randomly. He's driving. I'm like, bruh. He's like, dude, I'm driving. What's up? He's like, dude, that that is fire, bro. It's straight fire. He's like, what are you talking? Oh, you're talking about this song. I'm like, bro, that's the best Jets song, Jet Suck song you've ever done. And you've done a lot of really good Jet Suck He's songs. done a lot. Hey, so, you know what? That song is so good. I think even the Jets fan like it. Bro, mm-hmm. Dude, we're going to be blaring it. I'm going to have DJ Sick Turtle blaring it this weekend at the MetLife Takeover. It's going to be awesome, man. It's going to be good times, man. It's going to be good times. I don't know how we're only getting two and a half against the Jets. My God. Is that is that what the point spread is? I, that's what I saw it on Bavado last night when I was, I got the I put a bet on eleven and a half Detroit uh, spread. I'll tell you that against Cleveland, that seems like easy money. You know what the easiest money is? Not betting. Not betting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I man. wish I would have learned that one. I can't quit everything, Stephen. You know what I mean? I've quit everything in my life. My God, I've quit alcohol. I quit cigarettes. I quit all kinds of stuff. But you know what you quit haven't everything. quit? You know what you haven't quit? We being a Dolphins gambling, fan, being a, a Dolphins, Dolphins fan, fan, being a Dolphins fan all day. Yeah. Hey, Pete, man, what's going on, man? What do you think is going to happen this weekend, big homie? This weekend? Man, you just heard uh, one, two, three, four Epps lay it to you solid, man. There's a reason why there's a two-point spread. I am concerned as a fan. I am a little oh. worried. Oh, don't be worried. But- don't be concerned. No, be concerned I, for these Jet fans. We're about. You don't to want it to in. turn into a Pete's right. You don't want it to turn into a trap game after we just whooped the Ravens. There is no at they, bruh. At three and seven, there is no such thing as a trap game. Well, just coming so off know. a big game and going into a game to the worst team, basically the worst team, thinking you're just going to blow them out. You can't go in with that mentality. You got to go in as a dog. You got to be ready I to fight for are. your life. I think they are. Don't worry about it. I think our team has taken enough beating and everything to not come in this game ready and prepared. That, hey, exactly. Hey, uh, I, I'm a Superman fan. I love Superman. But you know who doesn't love Superman? Batman. Batman 2423 Shout in the out to my guy, Batman. What's going What's on, up, Batman? Morning, morning. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, hey, brother. Batman, man. I, I see you doing your thing over there, man. Good good, good content you, you're getting done over there. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. We're getting all the love we can from the community, man. I really do appreciate that. Hey, man. Guys, go check my man out. And promote Batman. your stuff. Promote your stuff, Batman. Well, right Batman, now, we're, I already we're, told uh, you. Yeah, Pete, <laughs> we were talking about this last night. So, um, we got Fins Nation Miami off of uh, Miami Football Talk. Um, so, we're just starting up, you know, and, and we're trying to, you know, we're building this from, from the bottom for now. And and we're going to take our, our, our lumps throughout the way. But, hey, man, we, we are passionate about this team, man. I love it, We man. love you the Fins. That's what um, I like to see. And, Batman you know, I already told everybody. you, man. Just do it. The more Dolphin content, the more we love it, the more we got places yeah, to go. And that's what it's all about, man, about all of us Dolphin fans reuniting and getting together. Because the media wouldn't do it, so we had to do it ourselves. It is what it is. You know what? I, I've said that. I've said that. You know all I mean? of us. Look, this is one thing I love about all of us. Whether you're in the chat or you jump on the panels, I don't care what anybody tells me, Steven and guys. We are the biggest Dolphin fans. There's no bigger Dolphin fans than us. Bro, we come to YouTube, okay? We come to YouTube for this content because we love it. And I I just don't see anybody being bigger Dolphin fans than us guys that come on YouTube for the Dolphin content. And ladies. Well, ladies ladies are. Yeah, ladies too. Ladies too. That's the reason I came on YouTube is because every time, even if we won, I would go on ESPN or whatever, and they would be talking about the losing team. And I'm like, yo, this is whack, bro. Like, whack Jones, this is whack. I need to find some real stuff. So Who? I went out there. Who? Uh, every time You're we, supposed I to say going, whack Jones. Whack Jones, yeah. I'm saying, like, every time we went, every time, even if we won, like, even when we won against the Ravens, they were talking about Lamar the whole week. 
If that's you true, know, they were talking about Lamar. You know what I'm saying? Week. Like, that's whack, man. I don't like that. So I was like, I need to go on YouTube and find some stuff. I found Sorry. Dougley. I found Kate Flexen. I found TD. And then I found the number one sports show, I mean, on, on, on YouTube. And then all of a sudden, it was just history. You know what I mean? Bro, I don't know who the number one sports show is. I don't know what you're talking that's, about. I think that's Miami correct. Sports Music right here. I like it, baby. I like it. I like it. Hit that like button if you agree with my boy. Batman, where'd you go, Batman? Where'd you Batman. go? Batman. Batman. Uh, Newport Joe made it a two-point spread. Okay. Uh, I don't know what you mean by Newport that. Newport okay. Joe, man. That should be easy. You see what I'm telling you? I had Who was the guy calling him a statue? That guy's going to be a statue. We're going to blitz him. We're going to hit him in yeah. the pocket. And at the oh, end Newport of the day. Joe. You're talking about Joe Flacco. I got you. I was like, how old yeah, is he? Joe Flacco. How old is he? How old is he? He's got to be in it. Late 30s. You know, what's, you know what's real talk? Joe Joe Flacco should not even be starting. It should be Mike Mike White. Mike White should start. I agree with you, Steven. Oh, my God. I Plus, can't believe I mean, they're doing Mike White like that. Exactly. I, I just need to know if he's really injured that bad for him not to go. But – He's not. They should not be playing. Nah, I wish it was Mike White, four man. Picks. They're mad he threw four picks. But but the the week before he was the best thing since sliced bread. That's what I'm saying. You know what I mean? Like, and, and then, got, thank you, buddy. I appreciate that. Everybody say hello to my wife. Hello. They said hello. I know it takes a lot. Good morning. Good morning. I know a lot takes a lot to keep up with Stephen, but hey. Well, she bringing me hot tea. I'm trying to tell y'all. Y'all be the, y'all better get a wife like mine. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> tell him to That's quit his I'm job, use- girl. That's what I'm gonna do to spread kindness. I'm gonna be nicer to my old lady because I I I've been a little bit short with her lately. That is, hey, that... don't be short. Be tall, man. Be tall. Yeah, let her yeah. Know, let know. That's what I do. So just so y'all know, my wife's a queen. My my wife's my queen. I love her. I hope she's listening right now to know I'm getting all these kudo points. My wife's the best. All right. Yeah, you're I'm winning. I'm, I'm, you're uh, winning, Steven. I'm winning. This holidays winning. coming up. You're winning right now. She yeah. got you that hot seat. <laughs> and, and I heard it's cold where you're and at. He, he needs donations because I'm I'm sure she wants diamonds or gold. Uh, well, the, look, right now, the donations are going right back into <laughs> everything else. But the goal is one day that, hey, this turns out to be something big. So let's keep on doing what we're doing, and it'll come to fruition. That's what I hope. All right, let me bring on EM Baller. And my kindness is laughing at Jet fans. Polo's in the building. Polo. What's going Polo, on, y'all? Hey, good morning, guys. What's morning. going on, gentlemen? Good morning, gentlemen. Y'all, y'all ready for some Spread Kindness Friday? Of course. Yes. Spread kindness Friday. Spread kindness Friday. Talk to me, man. Y'all talk, man. I'm trying to sip on my tea. What's up? How y'all doing? I'm doing good, man. I'm doing great. I always I always try to spread kindness. I was like I said back in my day, Stephen, I was really not a kind person. So I always try to respect people that respect me. And that's why you always see me I have a short fuse, because I had an anger problem. I don't know if it can be I don't know if y'all see that, but we're I working on that. We're working on yeah, that. Yeah, one, two, so. That's what we do. Not we have therapy sessions up here with one, two, three, yeah. four F's. Because when D one gets here up here, it's talking all crazy. One, two, three, four F starts to lose his mind, and we gotta remind him D one is the homie. Yeah, that's see, who I'm not see, I was never like when I grew up, man, people don't show I grew up in a different environment. I wasn't used to that because when somebody, you know what I mean? Like it was like when things Got yeah, heated in the conversation. I wasn't used here. to all love debates. You know what I'm saying? I was used to like, oh, you disrespecting me? You disrespecting me, huh? You know what huh? I'm saying? So like, <laughs> huh? Are you trying me, bro? You it's all yeah. now. Yeah, I was. Smoke? That's what Polo. I was used to. Polo? I grew up in a bad neighborhood in South Florida, and I was just not a good kid, man. I grew up. I grew up a bad kid. Like my life's changed so much, and that's why I'm so into the Dolphins because it keeps my mind away from all that other. BS, man. Especially when they win. Especially when they win. Exactly. They lose, boy. It gets a bra. Polo, what's up, Polo? What's up, Steven? What's going on, man? You ready for this weekend? Oh, hell yeah. I'm always ready to whip the Jets. I like it. I like it, son. Polo ready, boy. Polo is so ready. My kindness is laughing at Jet fans. That's a good kindness to have. I like that. Is that what you're going to do this weekend? I've never met a Jets fan. Do, Do you know any Jets fans, Polo? Yeah, I know a lot. I don't know any because I hate where do, you, where do you live, Polo? I live here. I live in Miami, but my uncle is a Jets fan. Oh, a, there is a, a lot Jets of Jets fan. fans in Miami. Well, you better so. have him on speed dial this weekend, boy. Can't wait to laugh at them. Hey, uh-huh. Unc. Hey, Unc. Come here. Let's watch the game together. Come on now. Let's watch the game together. Call him up, you call him up every touchdown and be like, hey, what happened to them, what happened to them Jets, man? EM Baller's in the building. What's up, EM Baller? What's up, y'all? Uh, great to be here. Good, great morning, and 
I'm excited for the happy, game against the Jets. Uh, happy, happy I wanted, spread kindness I wanted Friday to, to you. I wanted to what? I said happy spread kindness Friday to you. Yeah, happy spread kindness Friday. You know, I try <laughs> spread kindness regardless of the day. So yeah, look, yeah. look, I like that Ian Baller. He said it don't matter. Any day that ends in Y is a day that I like to spread kindness. I like it. Go ahead, Ian yeah. Baller. Go ahead. And I'm a little uh, disappointed that Mike White's not playing, only because he's like, oh, I should have been the first overall pick. And I saw him uh, only a little bit in college, and yeah, I didn't see much uh, that anything from him to for him to be a first to, for him to be drafted really at all. So I wanted well, you, that. You, you, you know what's funny, um, Rob, Robert Sala, defense. Robert Sala, the head coach of uh, the Jets, EM said. Uh, oh, y'all, y'all are, you, you know, a week ago, y'all were saying he was the best thing since sliced bread. And now that he had a bad game, you guys want to dog him. Give the man a chance. And then two days later, they start, they, they announced that Flacco is going to start. Well, if you go like, yeah, and I don't, what are you talking played, about, boy? Yeah, he played decent versus the Bengals, but he, it's, it's, um, everyone was saying, oh, this guy is the new franchise quarterback after just one game. Like he's a turnover machine, so that's I kind of wanted that. Yeah, but, the bro, Dolphins. you can't. He played the best defense in the NFL, li- arguably, right? So he did. He did. So like nobody, no good quarter. There has there have been good quarterbacks that have not played well against Buffalo this year. So I think personally, you should let the man play. Let him, let him see what he's got. But hey, if y'all want to throw in Flacco, who didn't score a point and, against and us last year, I don't, want I don't know Mike why White. y'all think it's going to be different this year. But Another reason I don't want Mike White to play is because his dad is such a nice guy. My God. You know Shout out I mean? to Mike White Sr. That's what I'm saying. He was such a nice guy. I don't want to have He's to a Dolphins to, fan too, I don't want to have to be He's like, oh man, fan. I feel sorry for Mike White after yeah, Jalen yeah. Phillips puts him in the dirt. You know what I mean? I don't want to feel sorry for the guy. So I'm kind of <laughs> glad. Mike that White Sr. would have loved for his son to destroy the Dolphins. Oh, I hey. would probably rooted for that too. I, I, I don't know if I would have rooted for that, but what I will say is I wanted Mike White. Mike, uh, but, I wanted Mike White. But, but here's the like, thing about Mike White, and I hope his dad is listening because I don't. I, I've called a few like people I that to I him know yesterday. I talked to Mike. Oh, White yeah, like yesterday. like what? Like how come he wasn't a hot commodity down here? Like nobody spoke about him down here. Think about it. When did anybody that lived in Miami or Pembroke Pines and everybody hear about Mike White? You know, doing things in, 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 on the field in high school or in college I like that. I don't think that, he was that, good in college. I don't. I don't follow college as much as I follow NFL. I follow college. He wasn't somewhere. that great in college. I don't I think, think he, he was good in Kentucky. college. He wasn't that great. Yeah, I don't think he was that good. That's why, uh, Pete. Yeah, but but neither because was, um, I, Tom, Tom, Tom Brady. Well, Tom Brady wasn't good that great in college either. Y'all. Exactly. You guys, I, I don't know if you guys remember um the quarterback from Kara City High. I forgot his name. Cal- Calvert. Something count like everybody knew who he was in the whole city. He rocked the whole city just by a couple games in Kara City. Even Lamar and he made Jackson. it to the NFL, to, to be, but he just went undrafted. Unless you I like seriously his... follow college football, unless you're a Mariota or a Cam Newton or no, Joe down Burrow. here it starts in high school, bro. Let's it start starts in high study. school in yeah. Southern Florida. But and, and if you guys want really good high school coverage, go to 305sports.net. Go check out that team over there, 305 Sports. There. An amazing group of people over there. Um, all right, let me bring out two people I got in the back room. I got my man Anthony Manzano and Alexander Diaz. What's up, gentlemen? Hey, Good what's morning. up? Hey, morning. Pete, what's morning. up, man? How's everybody Anthony, doing? Anthony, how you doing, bro? Good morning, gentlemen. Hey, what's up, Pete? How's everybody doing this morning? Everybody Good, man. Blessed? How y'all doing? Everybody staying blessed? Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Um, I, we're all blessed here, uh, Alex. We're all feeling good. The only thing is, I think I'm the only one concerned and worried about my team on Pete, Sunday. don't get me wrong. I'm concerned, but... I'm not concerned. I'm concerned. I, I stay. Am, I'm always concerned. Up, I feel blessed. I'm always concerned. But. The the only thing the only thing I'm concerned about is just that D line of the Jets going up against our O line. That's the only thing I'm really concerned about. Their front four is okay. I'm not. Uh, Steven, they're, they're, Steven, they're not the past okay. few weeks. Yeah, they're not even the, okay. The, the Steven's the right. Weeks I'm wrong. Gone. This season, I feel so numb because we've been so bad. The past, I, I don't want to be negative, but I, I'm so numb. And like, bro, we're on like, a two-game win streak, Anthony. Let it just let it wash over you. Let it wash over I, you. I can't, I can't have faith with with how the team hey. has been playing. Hey, man, seriously. Hey, I have faith. I have Michael faith. Michael Carter's a rookie. He has not been running good. They have no receivers that can even. Michael Carter. Count. Hey, I will say this. Michael Carter's legit. That kid. That he, kid might yeah, Michael Carter's that, yeah. but, he might be legit. He might be legit. But I'm not scared. Really good. 
Yeah, he just, his stats are not saying he's great. No. Let me let me bring on two other people. I got Joe Lee. What's up, Joe Lee? Good morning, Joe Lee. There's my girl. Morning, Joe, Joe Lee's Lee. in the building, people. And then I got my boy Logan. Fifteen is in the building. What's up, Logan? What's going on? New. What's going on? New what's going on? What's up, Joe, Joe, Joe Lee, uh, what what you think's going down this weekend, girl? Tell me what's going on. Oh, down. this weekend's gonna be really nice. Um, I think this is gonna be one of those wins. I don't want to put it like the Texans, where it's gonna be ugly. I don't think it's gonna be high scoring either. I'm gonna put it at 24-17 Dolphins. Okay. But I think it's gonna be really nice because. Our defense is going to be – they're going to understand that this is another catapulting win. So they're going to be able to go ahead and go after the clock. They're going to be able to kill him because he has no running game. It's going to be so much easier for our secondary to really cover the guys. That's what I'm saying about Michael Carter. I mean, I know everybody thinks he's really good, but their running game is I would say not. this. Michael Carter is good enough. I will tell yeah, you this. but their run game has not been successful this year. Yeah, he's the only person where I'm a little bit concerned because our our run stopping hasn't been consistent enough for me. It's been better. If it's been we better. Rick, Rick Juan him, Davis has been... I think we're good because, honestly, I don't yeah. see any major player or combination of players. And the, and the greatest thing is Joe Flacco cannot leave the pocket because that guy oh, is yeah, slow in the last cannot move. day. You know Unless what I'm saying? Michael cannot move. The, 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 <laughs> so he's gonna stand back there and he's gonna take that heat, boy. Yeah. That, that's the thing. That's that's the thing. That's what I'm trying to explain to you guys. He's gonna stand Jolie back there. Joey brought up a good point about. And he's Jolie gonna make up, that line up block. A good point about about a running uh, a running a running um against the run. It's been better the last couple of weeks. Absolutely. Raekwon Davis 100%. has really really. Raekwon Davis has really stepped up big time. Yeah. Ever since he came off weeks. IR. Ever since he came yeah. off IR, things have gotten better. Yeah, I agree. You see, you see a difference. Look at Joe Lee dropping knowledge out here, y'all. Y'all believe my girl alone. Joe she Lee's knows. smart, man. Joe, Joe I, Lee I, knows I stuff. Joe Lee's smart, though. I love Joe, your takes, man. Joe Lee, Joe, might have, smart. Joe, Joe Lee might have the second best um, logo, too. I Hold on. I got to ask, Lee. guys. Joe Lee, how many brothers do you have? Six. That's why. Six wow. Wow. She's a, a rider hey, with us, man. She's a pimp for life. more than them? Get your brothers you to sisters? come over here, Joe Lee. Lee Tell them, are they sisters? Dolphin fans? Um, so, yes, they're Dolphin fans. However, one of them is also a Steelers fan. So oh. I was, oh. he, well, Yo, don't no, claim no, him. No. Don't claim him no more. You got five brothers. You ain't got six. You got five brothers. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> don't claim him. Like I like and that one, Steven. He will end up in the NFL. I will tell you that. So. Okay. Uh, all right. Oh, that's beautiful. Nice, nice. Let Last him play time. for the Dolphins. See what happens. I'll be like, Joe Lee, I want tickets, Joe Lee, please. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, I'm already guys, Joe in the Lee's 72 club. Friends, so I'm getting tickets. I got like three people in the back room, and I can only fit one more. Uh, so I want everybody to just chill. I'm going to bring on everybody. But the next person I'm going to bring on has the best last name in the world. It's my favorite last name. Chris Lackis is in the building. What's up, Chris Lackis? Hey, guys. Good morning. How's good morning, John. Good morning, John. Good morning, John. What's up, Chris Talakis? Talk to us, John. Yo, where's Andrevius at? I haven't seen him in a minute. I don't know. I don't, I don't know, know, man. I hope he's Andrevius. Right. Andrevius. Andrevius to the principal's office. Please report Andrevius. I'm sure he'll be here with two office. of those five <laughs> touchdowns. Yeah, he'll come Look, back. everybody, I just love this right now. I feel like one big family on Spray Con this Friday. Everybody's just, I feel like we're just chilling, having, I'm having my tea. That's why, hey, that's why I've this been on the best camera. part about Friday that's morning. Why I've been hey, on Steven, camera, Steven, Steven, what's up? I know, what's up? I know yesterday, I know yesterday was Throwback Thursday, right? And mm -hmm. when you were talking with, uh, what's name about, uh, the Pat, about the, uh, Pat Jet, the, the Jet Games, D -dub? stuff like that. D-Dub? D-Dub, yeah. It brought it. That's it brought him boy. one memory. One one memory that I, I went to. I went to the game in 1996 at the old okay. Meadowlands, the year the Jets w went one and fifteen. That right. was my. That brought up a real good memory. I was with my uncles and a couple other family members. We drove all the way from Long Island, where we lived in Long Island, to New Jersey to watch the game because I grew up in New York and I grew up a Dolphins fan in New York. So my uncles. All right. Where, so, where do you where do you live now, Alexander? Pompano, Pompano Beach. Mm. I'll be up in New York. I'm I'm driving up later this afternoon. 
Hey, if you go to New York, you got to check out a spot called LMB's out in Brooklyn. Out in BK, Brook. I don't know if I'm going to the. I don't know if I'm going to the boroughs. I'm probably gonna stay in like the Jersey side, and maybe. I mean, I'm gonna be in. I'm gonna be in uh, Midtown tomorrow night at Slattery's. Make, Guys, make come sure to Slattery's you get some Midtown. Hot dogs. Make sure you get Nathan's, some Nathan's hot, hot dogs, dogs yeah. my guy. And some fries, <laughs> your pizza. But yeah, that brought Hello. up that that brought up the memories. Like I, like it was, it was the it was the uh, year they went one in fifteen. The the Jets and I, I just, I just, I just, uh, I just remember that I was I had so much fun. That was like actually my second game that I went to when I was a kid. Yeah, that was my second game. Let the me, first let game me... was in ninety four. Where, where, where was that at? The old Foxborough Stadium, the year Marino had his Achilles Bro. injury. The year Marino had his Achilles injury. So you, so you didn't see Marino? No, I didn't see Marino that year. I saw Marino the year that the uh, Jet game that I went to. I'm kind of jealous of anybody who got to see Dan Marino. I know. I know. Did, did, did you guys remember the first year we got Chad Pennington? Yes. Did y'all go to that first Jets game? No, I didn't. Okay, I, I didn't. I'm gonna tell you. I didn't. Me and my guys, we had tickets to that game, and we never even made it inside. Why? Okay? What happened? The tailgate because was so live. Because the right? tailgates were so live, bro. It was no getting in there. You you forgot everything, <sighs> and, and it was just a wonderful feeling. Like the Jets fans were going crazy, and Chad Pennington just started turning it up, and we were outside listening, and we were going crazy at the Jets. They were so mad. I loved that day. It was like. Oh. Hey, let me let me bring on an old school cat. Y'all know him. Y'all love him. He's one of the original people that was here since day one. Dolphin Don is in the building. What's up, Dolphin Don? Dolphin Don, what's up, baby? Good, Good morning, boy. everybody. Good morning. <laughs> Welcome to the Friday <laughs> Fins Fellowship. Hey, I, I, hey, I, I don't know about y'all, but every time I hear Dolphin Don, all I can think of is like a 70s movie. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> or, or, or Matthew McConaughey. His all voice right, is legit, right, man. Right. His voice is legit. I promise right, you, I right, think it's right. that little. I, when I look at Don, I think it's the son talking to me. Bro, it's it, so... yo, <laughs> Don, Don, let me ask you something. First of all, I, I, I'm going to put you on the spot. How old are you? Okay, I just turned 56 this year, y'all. Okay, so you were you were, you were you were in the That's 70s. Like, that, yeah. That, that was your era. Bro, yeah. And, and full disclosure, as a little young tyke at five years old, I was a... Jets fan. Oh, yeah. When I first watching, started watching football, uh, Joe Namath had just won the Super Bowl for the AFL, and it was like a big deal. And then, uh, and then came the Dolphins. In 1966. <laughs> how did so? How did you become a Dolphins fan, Dolphin Don? Larry Zonka. Larry Zonka. <laughs> Earl yeah. Mercury Morris. It's all yes, you yes. Mercury <laughs> Morris. Jim Kick that year. Jim Jim Kick. And not not AJ Dewey. Oh well, no, no, no. Ace this was way Ventura. before. Oh, uh, what oh, yeah. did you say, Joe Lee? I said Ace Ventura. <laughs> Ace Ventura. Ace Ventura. Was, believe it or not, yeah. that movie has turned a lot of people into Dolphin fans. New yeah. England yeah. clam yeah. chowder. Like Is that, that the red or the white? I can never remember that. My, what's your point, Ventura? Finkless oh, Einhorn. Is, Einhorn is Finkel. Uh, I'm so, I'm so jealous when I hear my mom. I, I have a pain down proof class. The noise you heard came from inside the apartment. You I'm should hear my mom tell best. me about her and her dad watching the 72 Dolphins, man. It makes me so jealous, man. Yeah, yeah you yeah. guys actually got to see a... a, a yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Look, I mean, I'm, my, and, I, and, and, and real talk. So I'm just a couple of years younger than you are, Don. Just a couple Okay. Just, just a couple. I was right. born in I was born in eighty eight. So <laughs> yeah, I said just a couple. And, what are you fifty uh, one, Stephen? <laughs> minus. Um, but yo, real talk. Like I like, I'm telling y'all, I don't ever remember the Dolphins being good. True story. Oh, I man. do with I do with Ronnie Brown and uh, Jay. They were okay. The they were, I, I went to the two thousand Colts game. I think it was like December something. It was a playoff game, and we beat the Colts. Yeah, in overtime. Payment, Peyton, Peyton Manning. I, I saw Peyton Manning. Lamar play. Smith ran in the touchdown. Lamar play. Smith was running. I saw uh, uh, Edron James. Edrin I went James. to that game. I was 17 years old. Hey, I, I had tickets to that game, and I was going wild. I remember that game. Hey, Epps, Epps. That that that, that was the year that um that was the year that once that ran Lamar Smith into the ground. Yep, yeah. yep, yep. Against the Raiders. Yep. The next week against the Raiders, 
he could have do nothing. No, Absolutely that's nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that game. I remember that game. I was at that game, and it was like uh, one of my like best memories carries. of any game I went to. Because I like mean, forty carries, two hundred something yards. He he just oh. he he just put in work that game. Yeah, and yeah. we were going crazy. I remember I was hugging people I didn't even know. I mean, I was seven. One, two, three, us was hugging people, kissing babies like. I mean, it was like we were going crazy, man. Okay, here you go. Here's what it was like in the seventies, man. One more person. I got one more person in the back. Y'all know him. Y'all love him. He's a trucker. It's not trucker Sean, but it's Lance. What's up, Lance? What's happening, brothers? Good morning, Lance. Long time, man. Been busy. Been busy. I love Lance. Lance's handle today is I'm a Tua fan now. There you go. <laughs> he knows. Love, That's just for yeah. Fred Kindness Friday. That's it. <laughs> yes, it is. Yes, it is. But no, I, I'm on to about two of them. Go up when you're breaking that. Up. I said, I, I, I want his socks to go up. <laughs> so we get a bet. So we can get a number one pick for him. <laughs> Oh my God, Lance! I can't. Oh, no. Listen, Lance Feels is a wrong. real trucker. The Lance chances, is most definitely I, a real trucker. I, I, kick him out! Kick him out, Steven. That's not good. Kick him out. <laughs> hey, did anybody watch the game last night? Uh, yeah, yeah, I watched that. I watched that sorry ass game last nah, night. Nah, I went to bed. I, I, I want you. I want you to know something. Did you see? Did you see? I could have swore I could have probably had a picnic behind that Patriots O line. Oh I swear yeah, I could have had a picnic. Mm-hmm. Well, I, the, the you, Falcons you, have had no pass rush all. But does that? But but Alex, does that say more about their offensive line or how bad Atlanta's rush? Atlanta's D line is terrible. But how, how? Atlanta's defense is not that good. Yes, but the but the Patriots' O line is actually not bad. They're really good. It's good. You, you but Tua did better me. than Mac Jones, right? Yeah, I would think he. I, I think he did. Yeah, absolutely. Tua did better than yeah. Tua threw four touchdowns. Yes, that is that is that is correct. But the thing, but the thing about it is that look, look how, they also look had how Calvin much Ridley. The defense was. I think Tua this was, was only sacked. like three Tua weeks ago. Four this goes to ago. show you, Pete, how big of a difference Calvin no. Ridley makes against with that offense. You know what I'm saying? Not having Calvin Ridley is really I hurting. Poured, I poured water on myself. No. Well, hey, this year, yeah, yeah, Calvin Ridley. You give two of that old line with for New England, I guarantee. Because I mean, up. if you remember that Falcons game, X was covering Calvin that whole time, and Calvin got the best of him a couple times. X got the best of him a couple times. Calvin Ridley ain't no joke; he's a superstar. Yeah, oh, so yeah, you're to hey right. Epps. When you think about it, the last game Calvin Ridley played was against the Dolphins. Ever since yeah, that, right. Xavier yeah, Howard had to send that guy into mental awareness. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't he do needs that. to practice on how to get open now because <laughs> Xavier shut him down for the yeah, whole Xavier season. Did. I think Xavier <laughs> won that matchup. And, you know, ment- I, I, I feel for Calvin Ridley because even I have him on my fantasy team and I'm not even worried about it. I hope he gets better. You know what I mean? Mental illness really needs to be. Fixed, you know what I'm saying? So hopefully he's okay. Yeah. But yeah, I, I understand yeah. the joke, you know. Sure. The joke out. is good, man. Xavier put him in a mental hospital, but not really. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I hope he does get better. Real talk, though, because I don't, you know, that's it sucks to have mental issues. I've seen so many mental issues that are just crazy, man. My, uh, Can I say one my, thing about that? Go ahead, Jolie. Go ahead, Jolie. A real quick, Jolie. one thing that I will say this. Um, and this is not to knock anybody because mental issues happen to everybody. I don't care whether you're a regular normie or a super athlete. Everybody goes through that. Right. But to me, the difference of what makes an athlete, either an average athlete, a good athlete, athlete, an elite athlete, or one of the greatest is their ability to handle that pressure, handle that mental um situation and still Absolutely. and push yeah. through it that's Absolutely. where you didn't really hear this <laughs> back in the day uh, in, in any sports really not the that it's thing, the it's one been person, forever but the you one, didn't hear it because players um found a way to push through that right, i think right. now you have more access to i would say better health and assistance where uh, you know more people are more open to it but uh, it I don't want to say it's a negative thing, but 
it, I feel like they don't have as much of that personal strength to be able to push through it. it all, like, it all so, started with hold on, Seah. hold on. It all started with Gene Seah. So let me let me say this. So um there's a there's a there's a video guys if you're if you're not talking put yourselves on mute because I'm getting feedback from you. Um, it ain't me, it ain't me, I know that. Um so hey look. There's a video surfacing online right now of a former NFL running back named Zach Stacy. And I'm not going to replay that video. Oh, but yeah. But it's, it, it, it's, yeah. it's, a, it's a wild video, right? And what I will say is, and this is no excuse one way or the other, right? I think we need to look at two things really, really big in the NFL. We need to look at mental health and a lot bigger issue for the players – before, during, and after their playing time, right? And there needs to be like so. There needs to be programs dedicated to that because you got to realize a lot of these people have a lot of these players have these anger management issues, or or, or you know they have aggression. They have a lot of aggression, and there's no way to nowhere to put that after you finish playing. So there needs to be programs dedicated to that. And the other thing that there needs to be dedication to is. Um, uh, the other thing that there needs to be uh, dedication to is there needs to be programs for um, the wives and girlfriends of these players too, because what you will find is what you will find is Alexander it was you, by the way, who I had the feedback from what you will find is, is sorry about that. Uh, it's all good. Um, is these, these wives don't have an outlet. There needs to be programs dedicated so that these, these women have a safe place to go to. And, and because th that, that was a crazy video. You could definitely tell by watching it there that she, that she's been in this situation before. That's why the cameras were there. Like she put those cameras, she knew it was coming. And yeah, like there needs to be, there's, there's a lot of stuff. It was a very sad video on all accounts. And that man definitely needs to be held accountable. Big, like all the way to the fullest extent of the law. But I think the NFL also needs to realize that I'm sure that's not the only situation it has, and we need to create programs to help with that. I agree with yeah. that, and I think it's yeah. really like they benefit from these players. They also need to take account and responsibility for the players and their families. So I agree with you when it comes to them having this type of responsibility as a well, as a union. Hold on, hold, hold on, Pete. Go ahead, Alexander. Uh, no, what I, was, what I was actually going to tell you, what I was going to say is that um, you're absolutely right. You know, right now he's on the run, you know, so they're actually looking for him. They have a warrant for his arrest. My wife was the one that actually brought that to me. She, She's the one that showed me to it. That's, and, a, that's a wild video. It's a wild video. Yeah, yeah. And, mm -hmm. and she, and, and I said, and I asked her, I was like, you know, these, these, you know, don't get me wrong, I'm not making any excuses for him whatsoever. This is that's a terrible video, and he, he needs to be arrested and sent away. But but what I, what I was telling her was, you know, he probably had something wrong with him up there. Like, CT probably got to him. You know, the CT, and she's like, oh, no, I don't, I don't want that garbage. At There's the no end of the day, look, CTE. at the end of the day, I, don't, I didn't see the video, so I, don't, I can't add anything. But it's what terrible. I do want to add is, only because you played football, you can't blame everything on CTE Yeah, because nowadays. I saw that growing up, For real, up, man. Pete. Everything can't be, be CTE nowadays, okay? You gotta be I saw that growing yeah. up, man, and it was regular people doing it to my mom, so. Yeah, but I think I think what, we, what we're what we By the way, Big John is in the building. I got Big John here, everybody. Big John stud, double O seven. Big John. Big John, take your stuff morning, off. Please John. say hello morning, to morning. the people. Good morning, Big John. Morning. Good morning. Big John, say hello. Say What's good up, morning. Man? How's everybody Morning, Big John. So I, I, happy spread kindness Friday to you. I miss you, man. <laughs> What's up, brother? Oh, uh, yeah? Hey. I you you, you seem kind of busy to miss me, bro, but I love you. Oh, see, there you, you go. You got a man. full panel. Every <laughs> hey, man, I miss you. I miss you. I'll kick everybody off right now. Just be me and you, Big John. That's how I really feel. I'll tell all these people, get off the panel. <laughs> Big all John right. gets that credit because everything he's ever said on YouTube on any panel he's ever gone to actually comes to fruition. You guys got. You're just mad because I kicked. 
You're just mad because Jacoby ain't playing no more for the rest of the year. <laughs> That's a different topic of discussion. I, me and you don't like each other because of that, okay? But I let it pass. <laughs> hey, guys, I got hey, Jacoby Brissett lover. I got somebody hey, hey, else. You guys, did you guys catch the video last night? Did you see it with Dono, uh, Steven? Who? You didn't catch me on Dono every Wednesday? You didn't see this Wednesday? Alex Dono, I, I, I see you. No, no, I gave I gave Pete credit for Jacoby Brissett getting knocked out the game. Hey, hey, you have to watch you. the video. <laughs> when credit is due, credit is due. Oh god, look at you! Hey, uh, guys, I have a I have a good friend in the back that y'all like, y'all love him. He's a Spurs fan, so he sucks oh. in that regard. But it's Estefan. What's up, Estefan? How are you, sir? What's Esther. up, y'all? Good morning. Good morning, Houston. Good. Houston. I'm looking Esther for the show, baby. <laughs> Look for Deshaun, Big John. I'm in Houston, bro. That's the fin I'm on the 16 freeway, but bro, I'm 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 hot tracking Deshaun's crib, bro. I got I got a, I got a bad That's joke. Fin. Go to your nearest massage parlor. I'm pretty sure you'll find him there. I said it. Yeah, I said the oh joke. Oh my god. That's the fin. He's hanging out in South Florida with Ross, the boss. Oh, I'll be wait. I'll be waiting for him in Houston though. <laughs> Make sure he he got a dolphin fan on his side. Did you bring okay. your oil? I, I, I ain't even you bring your about, oil. <laughs> I ain't thinking about this Watson stuff yeah. anymore right now, man. I, I can't. Got, yeah, I, I that, can't deal with no Watson stuff. I, 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 stuff. I brought, I brought, I brought it all, baby. I don't, I don't care, man. We, we. Hey, uh, you know, hey, hey, I have a question for you, Estevan. How are your Spurs doing? Somebody, <laughs> there we go. Bring Spurs up doing? Hey, man. Are we Watson. talking? Are we talking NBA? I don't think we 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 got on here to talk NBA, bro. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Now he want to duck. Now he want to duck the, yeah. the Spurs. I I All that the heat. Spin. And right way, now, Miami, Miami Heat hey, won last night. About the Spurs. Okay. All about the right Knicks. now, Miami Heat it's won. Okay. It's the first half of the season. You know what I mean? We we've had some good wins. I definitely uh, want to bring up. But hey, Sean man, Watson. that's the way it goes, bro. It's all about the Knicks. Hey, hey, who said that? Hornets. Alex, Alex said that. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, let's go Knicks. Nah, bro. Hey, uh, hey, hey, Alex, do you did you go? Have you been to um, uh, my boy who, uh, Richie's channel, Knicks uh, report or Knicks? Knicks I didn't get, I didn't get a chance. I didn't chance to check it out yet because I've been so Knicks busy media. trying to do some other media. Knicks go media, check out Knicks media. Matter of fact, Stephen, where man. is Jets Media? Richie, come Richie was up, up here, bro. Yesterday. Richie was up here. No, yesterday. I know, but he needs to come Richie, up yeah, here up now because yesterday. I need to talk to that kid. I need this. to ask him, where are those good cornerbacks, those shutdown cornerbacks he's been talking on every round table? How you need to get Hold to on. know wait, this wait, guy's wait, wait, name. Wait. Pete, Pete, I got to interrupt you real quick. Estefan, <laughs> what is your avatar? Is that <laughs> me <laughs> biting the mic earlier, bro? Yes, it is, bro. <laughs> I swear to God, yo, I can't with you, man. <laughs> I had to pause, Pete. I'm like, what the, what the heck great. is Estefan's avatar? Hey, I'm never going to forget. You get so close hey, to that Estefan. mic sometimes, Steven. I'm like, damn, can you just bite that mic for me, bro? <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I, I'll never forget the day that Larry got mad because Estefan put the picture of him drinking. <laughs> <laughs> drinking the kegger. Yeah. <laughs> Jolie, what did Larry you say? Jolie not. said something. I don't know what Jolie said. Oh, I said that you were hungry. Hey, I, I, I'm a fat man. I'm a fat man. I'm always hungry. I'm looking for that food. <laughs> ah, what what, what is he saying, Friday? Oh, she know about all the bootleg snacks. Uh, it's, it's out the wrapper, just like you like it. <laughs> hey, Steven, I, I got I got to shout out Solo D for the song, oh, but yeah, I, I just I hard. I question because. I question why he made it because you said he, that he had said superstitious for superstitious reasons he wasn't gonna make no songs because we were on a win streak. Yeah, but you gotta but he, make Jets suck. No, no. Jets suck is uh, totally. Stephen okay. went over. Stephen went over that yesterday on the show about oh, solo did he? D and his music. Yeah, I, yeah. Just listen. To I the apologize, show. man. I, I've been real busy, bro. I didn't even get to yeah, be a part yeah, of yeah. the show. Yeah, watch the uh, show every morning. God support the show. Steven, Why Steven don't you, bro? You, you, if you only knew the day that I had yesterday. But look, let me say this: if if we as, end as up the, losing this weekend, what are we going to say about Solo making this song, bro? Y'all can blame it on him. 
Blame it it's on actually me. Wednesday's show. I ain't do nothing. He went over why he's not making a song every week. Because, okay, know, and... maybe let's make a song on bye week. On bye week. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you talk. You talk to solo, Estefan. I ain't got nothing to say to that. You ain't putting me in that conversation. That's yeah, my brother. Yeah. From another no, mother, he, but I. No, he, he should do. He should do his thing. They, I'm gonna tell you right man, now. You know, solo D spoke facts. I you mean, want me to I tell changed you the rooms best to watch the game. What's the best? You know, lyrics? I changed sofas. Jets still suck. Even if we lose, the Jets still suck. I don't care. Oh, they always suck. Man, well, we gotta win. I have a question for Estefan and for Pete because I know you guys are, you know, have the loudest voice uh, a lot of the time. L- Come literally, on, Joey, liter- I'm offended. Literally, the loudest voices. But go wait, ahead. no, I meant like literally. I'm joking. Literally. I'm joking. <laughs> um, but and for you too, Eps. But as far as this new game, what would you say two key things we would have to do to secure the the win? Or for the panel, what do you guys think? What two things we have uh, to do? against the Jets? Pressure on the court. Pressure on the Shut quarterback. Shut down the run. Pressure on the quarterback. Pressure on the quarterback. Pressure on the quarterback. I, I hear a really yeah. bad feedback. Guys. Yeah, no, no. T- I think good That's defense and no turnovers, even if it's just field goals. Yeah, pressure on the quarterback. Good defense, no, no turnovers no, no. from. No I want to add my two cents in too, as well. No no my my no thing turn. is, honestly, we got to convert third downs. And we, we have to be, run the ball. Yeah, we have to run the ball. We can't be twenty percent third down conversions. And on defense, we just got to do exactly what we're doing. Honestly, I, I, I don't see us really losing this game, but I am concerned because I would have felt better with a Zach Wilson or a Mike White. That that defense we have would have confused Bro, do you them. do re- – Joe Flacco know. has seen no, all of bro, this. Joe Flacco has experience. Joe Flacco, Joe Flacco, Joe Let Flacco, the didn't, go, bro. Joe Flacco didn't score a point against us last year, bro. Joe Flacco is yeah. a third stringer, Pete. That's the old well, right there, right there, bro. Y'all yeah. scared of Flacco? Yeah, used to be. Hey, yeah, we, used, bro. we used up all our trap games this year. I agree. The with you, the Jets, There's a reason Joe Flacco won a Super Bowl. Yeah. And that's because Raymond. Exactly. Lewis. Yeah, eight years ago. Eight Raymond years Lewis. Ago. That's why he won that Super Bowl. No, 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 no. no I'm gonna give Flacco his credit. Flacco had, really had the. Cool. Flacco he had a good old line. He had no, a good Flacco, run game, and he Flacco, had a great defense. Flacco Edward, that year Edward had like Reed it too. was like 15 yeah. touchdowns, no interceptions in that postseason. And, and, and the Flacco Dolphins. And the Dolphins community, I hear you guys. You guys, a lot of you are scoring big points. But you see, I don't think you guys are really, like, up to date, right? You guys are just looking at the matchup and not really looking at our problem. We do have a problem at quarterback. Our quarterback is limited. He has a messed up finger. And so he... <laughs> see, that's why you dropped off, Pete, because you over there no, talking. Not talking not ugly. God don't like ugly. Karma. Karma. God don't Karma. like ugly. <laughs> Karma. <laughs> I, I think the weather is going to be a big factor this weekend. I think we're going to get northeastern too. Alexander, oh. Alexander, I'm calling you out, bro. What is up with your feedback, bro? Oh, that's um, where. It, it, where are you at? He said, my, he, he I'm said, you room, room, man. Man. I'm, on my air, I'm, I'm on my AirPods. That's probably why it's it's Apple products. That's why Apple <laughs> sucks. Android all day, baby. <laughs> Android all day, and, and I want, and I want to. The reason I'm not talking about Deshaun Watson anymore is because of Nostradamus, Big John. I, he, everything he says comes true. So he told me Watson ain't coming to Miami. I'm gonna go ahead and believe him because you know what? He said Nostradamus. I yeah, said, Nostradamus. I, I, I said, I said, I said <laughs> Nostradamus. Look at that nose. Call him out, Booger. Yeah, I mean, hey, everything he has said comes true. So he said Deshaun Watson ain't coming. Hey, maybe he ain't coming. Hey, hey, it's, it's, it's really cute how you guys say we need to uh, make third down and run the football. We've been saying that all year, guys. That's not gonna happen. Just make sure, just make sure you remember that. Just, let's remind Joe Flacco he's a statue and he can't move, and you know sack him like seven times. That should be yeah. enough to win the game. That's why I said we're not gonna run the football. It's not yeah, gonna, gonna happen. Yeah, like pressure it's gonna be all defense. The main thing is pressure on the quarterback. You have and to make him I'm the only one that's super pissed that the Patriots only suck for one year. I mean, we're not going to talk about that, Jolie. We're not going to talk yeah. about that. No, 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 no. no. We need to talk about that. And let me explain why. Because uh, I looked at the numbers. They can go nine and eight this year, or they can go 10 and seven. They're not going to go any higher than that. But that would really mean our last week, our last game that I'm week. I'm telling you right it, now, week 19, Jolie, Jolie, week 19 is going to come down to the last playoff spot. And it's going to be us versus the Patriots. It's it is. It's going to be on Sunday night football. Mark my words. 
Mark oh, my words. Uh, man, I don't know about that, man. I can't think that far ahead, bro. I'm just glad. I, I, I love I love night games as a season ticket holder. Oh, my God, I love night games. I, I got to say something. We have, you know we what have I'm looking forward to? You know what I'm looking forward to, y'all, is that the momentum that we're gonna we should get off a good win come uh, against Baltimore. Like I gotta be honest, like you know, even going back to what the last year of Adam Gates, I don't remember when it was a well, maybe the maybe the uh, Miami Miracle was was uh, had Hard Rock lit, Boy, but yes, it I don't did. remember. Yes, I don't did. remember that stadium like for how long it was. They 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 were energetic. I don't remember them being that energetic in a game. In a while, yo. That, and so that, I, what Thursday, I'm, what I'm Thursday gonna, night, Thursday <laughs> night, real talk. Thursday night, that place was rocking. Thursday night, yeah, I man. Like, and yeah, I just want that yeah, momentum to carry over to where they win this week, and when they come back, they'll be back home for three games. And bro, can you imagine if it's just lit for three games like that, bro? Man, I'm I think you, after about you know what, Estefan, what needs to happen, what needs to happen to that, is we go into New York, we take care of business in New York, right? Then we come back home. We play against the Carolina Panthers. Let me bring on Pete now. Uh, uh, we come back home. We play against the Carolina Panthers. We take care of Cam Newton and the Panthers. Now, all of a sudden, we go into the uh, – uh, is it Atlanta or a bye week? No, no. We play New Atlanta. Orleans. Or New Orleans. No, no, no. No, it, bye week. It, The Giants. The Giants. No, it, yeah. Then we yeah, take yeah. care of the Giants. Then we go into the bye week. If we go into the bye week, 5-0 and, seven and seven. our last five games will be 7 – no – we still have to win one more against the Jets, and then oh, we play. Please. And then we play against the Jets after the bye week. Then we'll be seven, seven and seven. seven. Then we'll be seven and seven, and then yeah, we go into Monday Night Football. Steven, that was a whole lot of ifs, oh, man. I, I, no, ho, bro, it's, not ifs. Bro. It's, it's, it's doable. It's not ifs, bro. It's, it, it, doable. it's very doable. No, no. Listen, listen. I don't Steven think is right because done. no team's listen, ever done. I'm That's always right. It's my channel. We did it. We did it before. He's always right. Exactly. And even when you're wrong, you can easily flip flop over That's here, right. baby. It's flip floppers. I can say whatever <laughs> I want and still be right. It spins up. It's not flip floppers. But listen, this is the this thing is because guy. before I got interrupted with that phone call, I'm sorry, guys. This is what I was saying. Tua, right now, his fingers still hurt. His ribs are still hurt. But by the time we come back off bye week, and let's say we beat the Jets um, on Sunday, not convincingly because we're still a little banged up. By the time we come back off that bye week, and like Estefan said, we're riding that winning energy. Yep. By by that time, I think Tua should be clearly a hundred percent and improving on a weekly basis. Before that, yep. If I see Tua come out against the Jets and throw a couple of those Jalen Waddle throws and a couple of those nice reads, finding wide open guys, I'm gonna come on here Monday morning and I'm gonna say I was totally wrong about this guy. He is improving and he's no, you can good. flip flop. You can be like, I I'll told you, I told y'all too it was the no, man. I ain't gonna do y'all that y'all ain't believe me. Wait, 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 wait. I, time out, time out. I, I, I hear you talking and that, that that was one, two, three, right? That's who's talking. Abs, abs. You call me abs. You're, 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 you're the guy who gave me the most incredible take in the history of takes <laughs> on this show. You told I, I I played it back to make sure I heard it correctly. You said Tua Tagovailoa threw four touchdowns against Atlanta because the defense was tired. Explain that to me. How, what, I said what? There's no way I said that, but yeah. Yes, you did. Play that doesn't, even, he, he uh, said, Big John, that doesn't that. even make sense, man. Big John, he would never say that. Doesn't even make like sense, that, bro. bro. You well, said saying, hey, I, I, no. Don't tell me what I said because I didn't say that. Hey. You said two or two, two touchdowns in the fourth quarter. You just said four, now you're saying two, man. Because defense, because I knew, Atlanta. I, knew were, I knew you felt some kind of way about that. I could feel it. But let me tell you something. <laughs> Listen, man, I did not say that. I said the reason Atlanta Falcons won and they got that last drive is because the defense of the Miami Dolphins was tired. Oh, then That's I heard it. Said. Yeah, Big John. You first said, I heard, heard correctly, well, Big John. Who would say that? That doesn't okay. make sense. Okay, all right. I'll, 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 I'll take it. I heard. Because when I heard that, I said, wait a minute. Take that L. Hey, hey, I, I, said, I said, damn it. If, I said, if that's the case, then when Dan Marino threw a touchdown pass and the, the, the guy that, from uh, the Jets didn't put his hands up, he had jock itch. I was like, okay. If I, if, I said, me. if I said the reason that they threw four touchdowns is because if I said what you said, that would make me a dummy. That doesn't even make sense. 
That's I was conf- that, That's why I was confused when you said it. Yeah, yeah. I thought you that said it. Even make, that doesn't even make sense. Big John. I said, I said the reason we lost the game is because our defense was tired because they were on the field too long in that last No, the reason we lost the game is because Brian Flores wasn't calling plays. They weren't blitzing. And Jerome Baker can't cover. And I've been saying it for 10 weeks. Well, that's and they still do point. it. That's besides the point. The point is I did not Guys, say this that. Break Big, Friday. I don't Big hear a John. lot of kindness. Big John. Little John here. What, what's, your John, little John. <laughs> <laughs> what's your score prediction for, uh, for the game on Sunday? 24-7. Dolphins, nice. right? Listen, Stephen, if you have to ask me that question, why am I up here, bro? <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just making sure, big time. Nah, oh, you, you, you already know. I, I you already know clarity. my baby I mama. Want... You already know. You already know my baby mama is a Jets fan. We've established this that I, I sleep with the enemy. It's horrible. Okay, just just Sorry. leave it there. All I'm saying, Big Jones, you might have heard me wrong, or maybe I said maybe maybe my words got twisted. I don't know, but. I don't think I would ever say something like that because that doesn't even make sense. I, 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 hey, play, go, go play it back. If, if I'm I will, wrong, I will. I will Big play John, it Big John, Big John. Hold on, hold on, everybody. Hold on. Big John, do me a favor. What's up? Next time you go to the store or you got to go anywhere with your wife, in the car, you have to blast Solo D's fins. This new song he just dropped Which for your I'm wife. Which I'm about to play right now. Great play segue. it for, and you have to play it in front of your wife, bro. Before bed, a whole weekend. Just do it for us. All right, guys. So what I'm gonna do right now? I need y'all all on camera because I'm I'm a, I'm gonna put y'all rock into this a little bit. I'm gonna make a little collage. Y'all need to get on camera right now when I start playing this song, and I'm gonna show y'all bob into this song individually here and there. All right, because we about to play the number one song of the year i'm talking about just still suck by your boy solo d right here on miami sports music let's go y'all hear it yep 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 New York. <laughs> somebody got off somebody didn't want to get on camera Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still, still suck. suck. And top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still, still up. <laughs> I had to take a break, was on a high eight. My team been doing bad, but they still my favorite. When I'm Jets on the schedule, then the fouls flake. Five fingers to your face, I'm like, hi, hater. Hey, plus my squad, they've been missing me. DWA, we stick together through the misery. When I pray, go down to New York, do you remember me? The one that loved us, spell your name, and always this your team. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, uh, uh, uh. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet man like your fans, hush, hush, hush. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, uh, uh, uh. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. <laughs> and when we yet man like your fans, hush, hush. Hey, I done hush. been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks Talk and I'm just John still beat. suck. Joe and even when we die, and I'm still suck. Hey, I done been around the world. And I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just, just still suck. suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Still up. Hey. Low, so low, so low. I can't, bro. So, so low, 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 low. Oh, so low, so low. Oh my low, god, so I can't low. with you, Pete. Oh Pete, my Pete, god, how'd you do that, Pete? Pete, we was we was bout we was bouncing, Pete. Send me that card, Pete, because I'm a Tua fan now. 
Hey, please. <laughs> that, that car going to be worth money, bro. You're going to be mad when that car is worth money one day. Hell yeah. Yes, 32 cents. 30. All right, yeah. <laughs> All right, you can't even get a pass. You can't even get a pass. You said you wrong for that. Oh, right, oh that was Zach Wilson. That guy's a bust. Anyone can have the tour oh. card. This is him in Alabama with a Dolphin jersey, too. Oh, my you, goodness. You got to love Pete, man. You got to love Pete. That was a tour card, right? That wasn't a Zach Wilson. If we, if we lose that Sunday, was, we know who the, we're going The one I Monday, ripped right? was a Zach Wilson. Oh. Oh. I yeah. thought it was a Tua card. Oh, no, the Tua yeah. card, Woman I was brother. showing it off. Right, let let it, go, back, go back on. Let's see that card rip. We need to see visual yeah. evidence. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Let me see that card rip, because I thought it was a Tua card. I'm going to put it back together. Can we see the card first? <laughs> Take Zach it back Wilson. together. Oh, it is a Zach Wilson card. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, Man, 36 cents. Little... Okay. All right. I thought it was a Tua card. This it is the tour car. You got you got Pete going through his trash, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm crazy. That tour oh. looked like it's in mint condition, Pete. You better keep that, bro. Okay. You know how long it took me to find a Jets card? I didn't want to rip the Zach Wilson. That's how bad they are. They Pete. don't even make Jets cards Pete. anymore. Pete, put your <laughs> put your camera back on, Pete. Hold on, man. I'm walking all over my house. <laughs> Zach Wilson was probably giving those away at the front gate. He oh, probably man. was. He was probably. Oh there. my god! Jets fans will probably be like, "Oh yeah, let me. I got a Zach Wilson card. It's gonna be worth money one day." Oh my god! It's up my pick. Oh my I gotta god. go back and watch that. I gotta go back and watch that episode uh, about me saying that because I know Big John didn't like me because of that. I felt it when that show was on, so I want to go and see that. <laughs> He did. Big I, John I, I has felt, called you out hate. plenty of times. I felt he the says hate that the I, reason why yeah, yeah, yeah. is because you said the defense was tired. I felt the I felt the hate from Big John. I, I mean, man, that, that, that's a, that man. It's a fact, though. They were because tired. I mean, I I'm very hate. observant. I'm very observant, and I felt the I felt the hate from him. I knew I he ain't believe, like. I don't me. believe the defense was tired in that game. No, no, no. I knew he ain't like me, Big John. I knew it. I knew it. Where he at? Big John left. Big John left. Yeah, Big John oh, left. Big John probably cried because he thought I broke a tour card. Oh, don't talk about my boy like that. Leave Big oh, John alone. That's my boy. Nah, but that, that day when me and John got into that argument, I felt I felt he was heated at me. I felt it. Oh, man. It, it is what it is. Oh. Hit Look, that like reality, pop. it's spread kindness Friday, I right? I still love Big People John, gotta, man. Like, like I everybody, said, listen, big, hold on. Big John's it's spread kindness Friday. Man. Hold on. People in this community need to realize. Pete, you need to get on camera if you're going to talk from now on. You have to Why? get on camera. You have to get on camera. <laughs> because you, you don't have Andre Mises. Yeah, yeah. Pete, you have, have, to, be you have to be on camera. Pete, you have to be on camera, Pete. I'm not letting Pete, you talk. Pete, you on camera. go on camera. You're not a bad looking guy. You're just crazy. Listen. I was about to say, you're, 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 hey. You're a pretty handsome guy, my guy. That's what I'm saying. You're Everybody don't want to look at me, guy. man. Look at you, man. Look, look at the beard. I love you guys, but come on, dude. Look, I'm oh, blushing. Oh, You're making look me look blush, me. man. Now I know what it is. Pete, do you Rock like Calvin Klein? Are you a Calvin Klein model? Oh, please, no, look man. You. Come on, bro. Hey, we're going to send you some details. Tell them to call me. Tell them to call me. Get you I'm some contracted DW. with Allstate. I'm in good hands, baby. But listen. Listen. I forgot what I was gonna say. This is look, look at look, me, man. Look, my boy's piece, piece fresh. Lost for words. My boy is fresh. <laughs> you better... The good-looking ones are always crazy. <laughs> they are. They are. They are <laughs> crazy. Crazy boy. Yeah, okay. I, um. I love it, man. Uh, oh, this is what I was gonna say. No, for real, for real, guys. You guys, when we're up here talking and arguing, like people, please don't take it like personal. You know, where where we argue, like what you believe our team is about yeah. or what you see and, and just don't take it like don't take it home offline and, and let that ruin yeah. your day no you know i know what I'm saying? that's and it's it's all for honestly at the end of the day that too pete and honestly i'm not used to that that's what i'm trying to say i'm not used to that i'm not used to having debates with friends i'm used to a different kind of thing you know what i'm saying and i'm working on it because we're, we're, we're gonna that's work on thing. it with you one two three four yeah that's we're a me make... thing man and that's for you know everybody that's for everybody that's a me thing everybody. you know what i mean and just don't take it personally especially so for like, like especially for like guys like steven and like td reason that make the content and also batman yeah. the new channel over there um like these guys are gonna have their opinions and you're not I always okay. You guys you will have, get bashed. I see comments. Like just don't take it offline. Exactly. You ain't gotta like my comments. 
but you got to flip flop. Nah, but I'm working on it with myself, <laughs> man, because I'm my whole life has been like a respect disrespect thing, and I'm trying to get over that. As friends can debate, and it's not no disrespect; it's all love. I get that, and I'm trying to work on that personally with me because I have a problem with that. Hey guys, hey, hey one, two, three. I got Yo. something to say. I changed my avatar for you, Pete, man. That's going right up on uh, one, two, three, four eps. Ah, Pete will be a two <laughs> fan Monday. <laughs> hey, hey, I might be a two fan Monday. No, hey, we all look at the end of the day, we're all two fans. Yeah, yeah. hey, I, hey do, real. Do, do I want two to succeed? Absolutely. Do I want him to go out there and throw four picks so D1 can say, Epps, I told you so? Yes, I do. I can't uh, wait for two to happy, show hey, up guys, and all of you guys home, scream at me. Hey, this is uh, over hey, this under. Is, how many touchdowns will two have this Sunday? How many touchdowns? I'm gonna say mm. three. Two is getting three touchdowns. Three touchdowns, Minimum. 326 Minimum. yards. Yeah. Two passes. I'm telling you. 27 to I'm gonna tell you guys yards. right now. It touchdowns. wouldn't surprise me if that guy has five touchdowns. It's five, not no, it because. <laughs> You that know, listen, crazy, listen, I when, right. hey, I, I feel it, bro. Like a lot of the like community, everybody's confused on what's going on and this and that. But I saw it in Flores eyes, bro. When Jacoby was going to come back in and, and said, Flores down, gave him that finger and told him, you better stay on the bench, buddy. Two is our guy. I just like, he said, Keep it your was, butt on the bench. yeah, it was speak. like, hey, he believes in this guy, bro. Yeah, speaking because of that injury though, Jacoby supposedly has a lingering injury because they they activated somebody from the practice squad i believe so there's another oh, yeah. quarterback in play now. jake delagano yeah jake delagano so I, I don't I, I don't know if jacoby's ever what coming back name. honestly you what might as name. well just put jacoby on the on, on the side that's the I don't perfect think south back. florida name jake delagano with a 70 yard bomb yeah i don't want to hear no jake delagano if we lose i don't want to hear no no <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that's not going to be the show. If we lose Sunday, that's going to be my new picture. I'm I know it is. That's hey, guys, hey, guys, real, real quick, real quick. This is um, this is the hype video that uh, Dolphins NYC made for this weekend. Hey, look at that stadium. That was. It's always good to be here. You know, I mean, when you look around, you see all these Dolphins fans here in New York. This just looks like the Miami North. Shout out to Matt Moore. Bro, it's, it's going down. It's going down, y'all. Y'all, y'all don't even understand. It's going down. It's it's Man. going down. I'm telling you, this it's, is the last that's a, year that's I'm a missing crazy any takeover. Video, boy. After this year, I'm going to every MetLife takeover. Bet. Me too, 100%. Pete. Me too, brother. This is the last time I'm ever missing that. After this, I'm there every year with you guys. I don't even care well, who I cancel on. Yep, and I don't even need a hotel, too. I can stay at my uncle's house. What do you mean? There. We're staying with Steven, bro. <laughs> I, I, hey, yo, I'm, Miami I'm Sports st- Music, baby. I'm, I'm in his hey. room. Uh, y'all, y'all in Maryland? donate, donate to the channel. Donate to the channel. That's all I'll say. Donate to the channel. Shoot, we ain't sleeping, man. That city never sleeps, right? <laughs> this is the city that never sleeps. You are correct about that. And the city that has the best food, best pizza, and the best Chinese. Food I don't want to hear anything no, wait about a minute, people. Wait a minute. I don't want to. Hey, the Steven. Best pizza in New York, but when I went, good. it wasn't good. So, Steven, let me what? tell you, I've been to Baltimore a few times. And I don't want to hear anybody tell me that Miami drivers are bad. You got to go to Baltimore and see how these guys in Maryland drive because even, I almost got ran over by a taxi driver. Bro, bro, you 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 preaching to the choir, man. Preaching to the choir. <laughs> What's I'm the glad best you know. know. The best drivers are in Tampa, yo. Tampa. Uh, yeah, more. but everybody thinks that the, their drivers are the worst drivers where they live at. Everybody thinks. I know, that. yeah. That's true. Because I used to think it was over here until I went to Baltimore. You got uh, you got LMBs out there in Brooklyn. That's the that's a good place right there. You got yeah, LMBs, you got to go, go get some New York bagels. 
go get some make sure dogs. everybody who's i am excited yo real talk i'm so excited to have some new york bagels some locks and bagels best thing in the world bro oh you got to get up to positano everybody man. who's traveling to the game before i forget it man stay safe and and safe travels man bro, well, yo, it's gonna be fun bro oh yeah this is another key factor that i was trying to say earlier on about the dolphins and jets game I do not want to see us attempt to run the ball in goal line situations. Well, you have to. You have no, to. You have no, no. I want two of the pass it all three times. You First, can't. second, and third down. You have to, bro. Uh, can't, we can't no, run it. It's a loss of down. How many times have we ran it in goal line and this is just a loss of play? Because you have to. You can't just. To me, it's a pass loss of play. It. Please, bro. You Flores, if you're listening. Down at the one yard line. Pass Pete, it, you're turning into Pete Carroll, man. I feel you, but we got to we got to learn that, man. And also, Gerald Dokes is he said turning into Pete starting. Carroll. Really? Yeah. Bob, <laughs> Bob, 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 what's up, Bob? That was a good one, man. Hey, well, yeah, you have to on the you have to run the ball. If, if if it takes, give it to Christian Wilkins. He'll get it in. I know, but we got the kid, uh, Jared Dokes, man. We should be trying him out a little bit. Yeah, well, I don't they think should, they've activated they, him. They should be doing that to Kirk Merritt too, but we're not going. Yeah, go we're not going. I say, I don't know why they have not dropped some passes. Like they do, and then we can try him again. Like they do, Patrick Ricard. Like they did, Refrigerator Perry. Hand it to Christian Wilkins. This guy wants to score. I think he, he has. He did I catch think, a touchdown pass two years. Yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah, remember. I think and he priority. fumbled. The, and he fumbled. Can we make sure he stays? It had already passed the goal line. I think. Priority this season is to give Robert Hunt the ball to get a touchdown. That's got to be made up. For. To go, I want the Dolphins to make a push for Kareem Hunt. That's yeah. who I want to see on this roster. Hey, Stevie D got a front row seat to that, didn't he? The so Robert Hunt touchdown. Yo, bro, I was only <laughs> so I'm in the first row with like the gorillas and everything. I'm in the deep end, and I'm sitting and I'm standing in the first row. Gorilla Luke and Gorilla Josh are right next to me. And then I have Dolph Freaky next to me and Stripe and all the people there, right? And so when that happened, I was like, Fat Man, rule the world. Let's go. And me and Gorilla Luke were rubbing our tummies when that was happening, bro. No lie. I was <laughs> all excited about Robert Hunt doing it. When they called that back, boy, I was so mad. I was so <laughs> mad they called it back. I was laughing so hard. My wife's like, my fiance's like, What are you laughing at? What are you it, it it was there's a penalty in the play. I was like, I don't care. That was the greatest not touch I've ever seen ever. Yo, what's crazy about it is it won like all those little talk show awards, like touchdown yeah. of the week, play of the week, and yeah, it wasn't even a play. You see, it was called see, like, it was yeah. not you guys. You see, you see, you guys look at that play and look at all that propaganda, and I'm there thinking like, look at the media making fun of us, bro. And they and, and this is what I got. Well, they weren't making fun they of were, Robert. Oh, they weren't it's not like like, like that's they're, a they're that's props. a make that's a penalty, bro. And, and they're why is your offensive line looking back for the ball? I've because never Miles seen Gaskin, that. He hey, I'll tell you the reason why. I'll he tell was you looking why. back to see where he needed a block. Right, I'll he say, he I'll couldn't go. You need to look yeah, forward to see who you're going to block. Yeah, but he can't. He can't look at Gaskins. He was trying to look at Gaskins, and the ball came right to him. Gaskins got lost in that shuffle. Gaskin yep. was so small well, that you couldn't even see where he was. And then Robert Hunt's like, oh, the ball's going to me. Okay, let me catch it. Exactly. I'll tell you what happened. He I looked back and said, I can't believe was, that guy. And he saw the ball, and he just made a football play. That's His mind just went somewhere else. Because he looked back to see where Gaskins was. <laughs> then he saw the ball, and he's like, okay, boom, caught it. And he went oh, back to backyard man. football. They they should drop they should drop his awareness like eighteen points in Madden for catching that ball. No, absolutely, no, not. absolutely they need to not. Play, and they need to make this get that touchdown because he deserves it. Because imagine if that ball was tipped, Pete. Imagine if that ball was tipped. Hey guys, well, if it was tipped, that's a legit catch and run. That's what I'm saying. Guys, imagine. I'd say I'd say, I'm going to tell you this right now. Um, you guys ever go on TikTok? Yeah, I do sometimes. There's a Baltimore Ravens fan on there on TikTok. That <laughs> is it. Is it? What's his name? I think. Oh I know my what talking about. God! I forget. I like his literally name. think I know him. I forgot his name, but uh, he's always on there. Is it engraven? I I think so. But Brandon Jones called him out, and actually, no, he called out Brandon Jones because Brandon Jones was um. <clears throat> After he after he made a after he made a big stink about how the Dolphins cheated in and it was the refs 
It was the refs against the Ravens. Brandon oh, Jones. Please. Is- the only, the only yeah, reason they I got mean, a touchdown was the refs. Get out of yeah, here. Like, I mean, yeah, the refs are, dude, that touch, the last touchdown they got was all because of the refs. I mean, Javon Hall chest bumped somebody and got a, got a rough in the passer car. Are you kidding me? And then, no. and, then, and then he goes, yeah, I fall, oh yeah, that, that was that was dreadful. that was atrocious, man. I'd never seen anything like that. I thought the yeah, Jerome I, Baker penalty was not was not even a rough in the past. Well, I can see that one because he put his weight on him. Okay, uh, you know but what bro- I mean. I'll, I'm still going to complain about it, but that Javon Holland call that needs to be brought up to the next meeting at the NFL officials. They need <clears> to show you what not this ridiculous, man. The refs' calls have been getting worse this, every this year. Whole, yeah, yeah, this whole year has been bad. Like they if you to, watch the Buffalo and make, Jets game, they need to make them full time. They, they need, need to make roughing the passer. They need to make roughing the passer a uh, a challengeable call or a or something you can look at. All hey. they need to do, whoa, whoa! What All they that? need to do is show the Buffalo Bills game with Mike White and a lot of those hits that they didn't call a flag on that a lot should have, in my opinion. And then they need to go to the Dolphins and that game and look at the Javon Holland hit because. There was clearly bigger hits that should have been called. That wasn't the even a hit, though. Jets game, and Holland didn't even hit the guy, and they called he didn't it. Even like, touch that is LB. BS. He, he, that was, he put was, his he hands in the air. air. He put yes, his hands the in the side. air. Like, like, yeah. It stopped, and his chest bumped him a little bit because of his momentum. He didn't yeah. do anything. See my, see my momentum. Oh, I agree. I agree. We need to go back to the Raiders game and actually give us that – uh um, PI call that we didn't Will Fuller, Will Fuller we, yeah. We all know it was a PI call, so I don't care what anybody. Yeah, Tom Brady gets that call nine times out of ten. You mean he gets it ten times out of ten? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that would have been if we if we got that PI call and they didn't score in the one yard line in overtime. I would be like, oh, that is so Dolphins right there. To get the so it's get, clear basically what's penalty, going on around the league is that the home the team, the home team usually gets the advantage on the calls. That's the home team advantage. But it's always been like that, Pete. The mm. problem this year is that they're overly. It's just that, yeah, this year it's just That's way, way overboard. Because they're, they're obvious plays. They're 50 50 call plays where they call, and you're like, okay, I can see why they yeah, would call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, you got to think about it. Plays hey, I, that I, calling I love- or not calling that you're like, come on, that is that is clearly that when you, we, 15 yards. When How you hear the, when you're the announcer saying this is ridiculous, I mean. You know, well, I mean, how, are they they how are they not reprimanded? They need to be fined. They need to be suspended, just like the player. Yeah, a player yeah. And they do a dirty play because these are making out- outcomes the of the games. And they're fine. You know, yeah. Oh, did you see that crazy. one where the where the referee where the referee hit bump uh, that one guy? Oh, yeah. Look, look, look yeah. this is what I've said yeah. before. Yeah. I, I've said this before. I'm sorry, Jolie. I hear you talking, but sometimes you're low. I'm so sorry, girl. Sorry, can you hear me now? Yeah. That was saying that hip check, what what um I am too a fan now is <laughs> said that hip check with the ref where it really wasn't a hip check. He was already holding on to the flag and then he put his butt out and then gave the guy the five the uh penalty. It, it's stuff like that it's, it just frustrates me because yeah, it's yeah, I agree, Jolie. You know, Blake Coleman has a reputation for that too. All right, I've, guys. Seen, I, I've seen Blake Coleman do that before. That, that just really pissed me off. This is but, what I wanted to say but, about the referees. Look, look at go look at the Saints and the and the Tennessee game last week, where Ryan Tannehill threw that pick, and they called it back for roughing the passer. Oh, that was a terrible call too. My, I, God. I was like, oh my God. The All right, NFL. guys. Hey, 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 hold up. Let's do final thoughts of the day because I got. This is my final this. thoughts. This is I my final get, thoughts. Pete, you go, and we'll start with you. And by the way, hit that like button if you haven't hit that like button, and donate to the channel. Help the channel grow. Let's go. All right, Pete. My final thoughts is everybody have a blessed weekend. Fins up. Hit that like button. You know where you get that good sports um, dolphin content. It's over here and every other channel as well. But my final thoughts, honestly, right now, Stephen, is about the referees. I'm going to just say this, and I'm going to go, and I appreciate you having me up. I honestly believe that ex-NFL players need to get paid and become referees. They know the game more than these other guys that are just becoming referees. So, therefore, I think when you're in the NFL, you know, you, 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 you end your career, just try to get these guys to become referees, pay them a, a, a very good amount, and let them, these guys do real good service. 
because these games are win, won and lost sometimes, believe it or not, by a bad call. We've seen it in the playoffs in Green Bay versus Minnesota. We've seen it in crucial games, and it, and it continues to happen. So yeah. I, I really dislike all these bad calls, but, again, there's nothing we could do and just continue to be fans, right? Everybody, thank you, and have a blessed day. Love right, you, be, take care, bro. Be good, buddy. Be good, man. You will, brother. All right, who's going next? I'll go. Go ahead. All right, yeah, uh, Pete, uh, just to piggyback on that, I think there will be some accountability because now the NFL lets you know people bet. So, hey, money's going to change, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Have some kind of effect there. Uh, but I got a couple hot takes for y'all. Uh, the Dolphins Jets series is tied currently. Uh, so, uh, we've won the last, what, four games? Uh, and we're, now we're tied. So, we've got to win this game to, 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 to get over the hump. Uh, and the other thing, the best thing that came out of the Robert Hunt scandal is uh, that uh, that I learned that Coach Flo is actually uh, Dr. Spock. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just waiting, I'm just waiting for the ears to go pointy, man, because uh, all I saw was a penalty. Yeah, you know, yeah. He literally <laughs> said I, 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 cal- I calculated the light speed with the light force, and what I had to say was is that this is the best o- object for us to get the touchdown. That is what I think. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I'm waiting for them pointy ears to come out in the next press press. Conference. By the way, I do like Star Trek, but yeah, I do too, bro. I do too. <laughs> yeah, well, Star Trek. Yeah, yeah. Star Trek's fire. Yeah, so, the, movies. Star Wars. the movies, the last movies with Christopher Pine as as uh, as uh, Captain Captain as Captain Kirk. Ah, oh, bro, I'm an old guy. I like the series. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Hi, right, Dolphin Don. I appreciate you, man. Be well, wish everybody. You were, wish yep, you were coming you out this weekend, day. bro. Me yeah, too, man. man. Me too. Uh, be well. S- support Steve, man. It's it's hard work doing this every mm-hmm. single day, y'all. Y'all don't know the work he's putting in. Say it again. Say it one more time for the people in the back, Dolphin Don. They don't know. Fins up. Support him to Sim. Appreciate it, Dolphin Don. Love you, brother. Long All right. Let's go to Polo. Polo. Uh, go ahead, bro. Final thought is I hope the I hope Flores schemes the defense like I hope he switches it up and this guy is the zero blitz because you know Flacco's an older quarterback yeah. he has more experience so you know he, he might beat us a couple of times but if he if he disguises the zero blitz I think we could have a good game final score prediction for me is 2013 um also one last thing I want to say is a uh, shout out to cock blockers the number one morning show and support Steven I appreciate that, Polo. That means a lot, man. Thank you. I appreciate it. Awesome, Polo. You have a great weekend, brother. Take care, hey, Polo. Hey, real quick, just to let everybody know, we got a new member to the family. Chase, Chase. One just signed up to become a member. Appreciate welcome, it, Chase. Chase welcome to the family, baby. Welcome, Chase. Welcome, welcome, welcome. to the family. Welcome. welcome to the family. All right, let's uh, let's bring on uh, Alexander. Alexander. <laughs> Somebody, somebody. Hey, who is that? I don't know. Uh, I think but, it's Lance. But go ahead, Alexander. All right. My fa- my final thoughts, you know, is um, you know, a couple of things is we just got to stop the run. We gotta we gotta slow down Michael Carter, you know, and we gotta get pressure on Flacco and just see the protect Tua, you know, and and keep running the ball, you know. Eventually, you know, Gaskin is gonna break one, but I predict. I predict. I still predict a forty-five to ten beatdown of the Jets on Sunday. I I still think two is going to ball out that game. But I uh, just want to also wish everybody, you know, a great weekend, and I want everybody to stay blessed. And uh, you and again, just enjoy the game Sunday. And I will, brother. Fins up. Let's go. Wish, wish you were up there, man. Uh, stay here, here man. Alexander. Watch, have a great watch, weekend, watch, man. watch, watch all the content this weekend, tomorrow night and Sunday. I will. I definitely will. Let's go Dolphins. Let's go Mets. Let's go Knicks. No, no, hey, let's no. go Islanders. Let's go Dolphins. I don't know Everybody about the last two, but hey. Yeah. <laughs> Take care, All right, guys. Alexander, Stay be blessed. good. All right. Let's go one, two, three, four, Eps. All right. Uh, once again, man, Miami Sports Music, best morning show on uh, on YouTube, man. Support the channel. Chase, welcome to the family. All of you guys that are going to the game, safe travels. Enjoy it have fun with each other and uh 
last thing I want to say is, Big John, if you're listening, if we, if any time in my argument I ever uh, offended you, I do apologize. I'm working on myself with that, so I hope Big you John. didn't take it Big bad. Big John loves you, bro. Big, I hope Big you didn't John take it you. bad, man. I, I love you, Big John. No, no, no hate here, man. And Joe Lee, you know, uh, I love your takes. I love being on the show with Joe Lee. She's just one of the best. So uh, I'm going to say 20. So I'm going to say 27-10 Dolphins. We need to put pressure on Flacco, make him uncomfortable, and reset the line of scrimmage, and we win this game easy. And uh, like I said, man, fins up. Love to everybody. And uh, have a blessed weekend, and you guys stay safe, man. Have fun, Steven, and thank you for letting me on, man. You really, really uh, – you're a really good guy, man. I really appreciate everything you do, brother. Hey, man, I appreciate you, man. Thank you so much for those kind words. I appreciate it. All right, fins up, brother. All right, man. Bye, Bye. I was hoping Lance would come on, but Lance said he's in a bad spot. He said he keeps losing his connection. So shout out to Lance, Trucker Lance, uh, for for the love today, bro. Um, all right, I'll, hold on. Before Joe Lee goes, let me bring on this this Spurs fan. Go ahead, Spurs fan. Final thoughts of the day. Take yourself off mute. All right, man. Uh, love everybody here on the panel, but man, I just want to address Ev, bro. That's too much apologizing. Just say what you, say what you want. Mean what you say and just disregard mean what you whether say. people like it or not, bro. Who cares, man? They can kiss your ass. Hey, Fins up, swear y'all. jar, swear jar, Estefan. See, this is why we can't have nice things. People like people like Estefan can't have nothing nice. All right, go ahead, Jolie. What's up, Jolie? <laughs> Estefan is ah. funny. Uh, well, uh, well, thank you, Stephen and MSN, for allowing me to voice my opinion as. Um, a Dolphin fan, sometimes we don't get the opportunity to do it, and your platform really does allow us to do it, and it's very exciting to to talk to the guys and kind of get their takes, too. I really love it. Eps, everybody. Um, but as far as my final take for this weekend, I really am going to stick to 24 um, 17 Dolphins, and the reason why I say it is I, I predict that the defense can get I don't know if it's a pick six or a scoop and score, but we can definitely get a defensive um, score. And also I think that our our offense is going to be able to pull, string things together this week because the last two weeks they've shown that they've been able to do it and we're going to have that continuity. I'm very excited to see what we did, what we do against Flacco. I, I'll take the challenge. If he wants to uh, start and wants to come you know, at us, Welcome. The I guess Salah doesn't know what he's doing by placing him as the QB, but that's all better for us. But as far as the Dolphins, I mean, one game at a time. You know, we all want us to get to the the uh, Super Bowl, but the we got to go land. one game at a time. So, uh, fins up. Love everybody. Thank you so much for having me, Steven. Support the channel. Uh, the um, <clears throat> flip floppers. Number one, Miami. Flip floppers, <laughs> home of the number one Miami <laughs> fan morning show. Flip floppers, baby. I appreciate exactly. it, Jolie. Of course. And you know what? I heard you about my logo. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, that logo is fire, Jolie. I do like it a lot. Thank Easy. you. Have a bye, guys. Oh, man. What's up, y'all? What is going on? What is going on? Spread Kindness Friday. I had a great time hanging out with y'all today. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed it today. Hey, if you can, donate to the channel. Donate to the channel. There's a lot of uh, good things that goes into that. Uh, I'm going to play the song one more time. Uh, but in order for me to play the song, I need is 57 likes. So I need to get to 60 likes, and I need three donations. 60 likes and three donations, and I will play that song one more time for y'all. One more time for y'all, and I will play it. I will play it for y'all because that's the type of person I am. That is the type of person. See, I'm even adding it to the stream. Let's go. Three more likes. Three more likes. I'm just saying three more likes, three more donations. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, let's see here. Uh, Trucker Sean says, see y'all Saturday. Hey, Trucker Sean, we'll see you Saturday. I appreciate that, man. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's see here. I guess y'all don't want to listen to the song. Nobody wants to listen to the song this morning. Just going to drink my tea. Because I'm super dad. Super dad. Let's see. Pretty boy. Hey, man. What are you driving up, pretty boy? 
When are you driving up, man? Chikanda. Let's go. Come on. All right, we got the three likes. Donations. Let's go. Support the channel. Help the channel grow. Matter of fact, let me, let me do this. Copy. Planet super bad. I'm leaving tomorrow at 9 a.m. Okay. All right. That's what's up. I'm leaving sometime today. I don't know when, but I'm leaving. It's going to be a lot of fun in the jet still suck. Let's go. Let's go. Huh? Y'all want me to play it one more time, huh? Y'all want me to play it one more time? Come on now. We got the likes. What up? All right, there we go. There's a $5 from Pete. Two more donations. $5 from Pete, my guy. My guy. Two more donations. Let's go. Appreciate the $5 donation, Pete. Thank you, sir. Thank you, good sir. Thank you, good sir. In the jet still suck. Let's go. Two more donations and we'll get this party started. I might even play it. I might even play it a couple of times for y'all. I'm just saying. Two more donations and we'll get there. Let's go, Pete. Pete done started us off. What else? Come on now. Y'all want to hear the song one more time? Come on now. Donate to the channel. Help the channel grow. Let's go. I'm holding the song hostage. Uh, thank you for putting in that work, Stephen D. Uh, hey, man, I'm trying, Bleezy38. I'm trying. It's a lot of work. This probably needs to be coffee instead. I'm going to probably sleep like half the way up to New York. Because I'm not driving. Thank God. Thank God. Polo here. Play that to a gospel instead. I don't have the to a gospel song. D1 has it. But I wish I had it because I would play the hell out of that song. Yeah, I said I'll put a dollar in my own donation bar, uh, jar. Uh, Bleezy38 says, I see you. Yeah, man, I was I was like thinking about it the other day. I'm like, man, I've been all up and down the East Coast and as a matter of like three weeks. Florida, all the way up to New York, doing live shows the entire weekend. <sighs> yeah, I'm tired. <laughs> I am tired. There is no doubt about that. Oh, man. Look at that. Oh. One more, one more donation, and I will play the song. One more donation, and I will play the song. Play that funky music, white boy. Play that funky music. Y'all don't want to hear me singing. Y'all better donate if y'all don't want to hear me sing. I'm going to start singing. D1 holding it hostage. He is holding it hostage because it's a good song. One more donation, people, and I will play the song that y'all want to hear. Y'all think I'm playing. Let's go. Let's go. Got 44 viewers left. I know y'all want to hear it. I know y'all want to hear it. But it costs to be the boss. Yep, yep. Let's see here. We're just going to sit here and stare at each other. That's what we're going to do, huh? We're just going to stare at each other. I need to go get a haircut and a shave before I leave, too. 
Good thing it's like right down the road. Please, he enjoyed meeting you at the Chase One. I feel like I'm Shula. I'm feeling like I'm Shula. All right, Chase One. There we go. Drop the link, Stephen. I called your job and you're not on the schedule today, bro. <laughs> Oh, uh, you funny, bro. You funny. Okay. All right. Here we go. Let me uh line it up. Y'all ready? Make sure, hey, in the chat, make sure y'all can hear it. That new solo D, Jet Still Suck. New York. Appreciate it, Dolphin Don. <laughs> I'm back. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm Jet Still Suck. Sit up big trees and the jet still suck. They get top three picks and the jet still suck. And even when we die, and the fence still up. Hey, I done been around the world and the jet still suck. Sit up big trees and the jet still suck. They get top three picks and the jet still suck. And even when we die, and the fence still up. <laughs> I had to take a break, was on a high eight. My team been doing bad, but they still my favorite. When I'm Jets on the schedule in the five slate, five fingers to your face, I'm like, hi, hater. Hey, plus my squad, they been missing me. DWA, we stick together through the misery. When I pray, go out to New York, do you remember me? The one that let us spell your name and always this your team. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, uh, uh, uh. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet man like your fans, hush, hush, hush. J E T S, suck, suck, suck. F I N S, uh, uh, uh. When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet man like your fans, hush, hush, hush. Hey, I done been around the world and the Jets still suck. Sit up big trees and the Jets still suck. They get top three picks and the Jets still suck. And even when we die, and the fence still up. Hey, I done been around the world. And the jet still suck. Sit up big trees and the jet still suck. They get top three picks and the jet still suck. And even when we die, and the fence still up. Jet suck. Jet suck. Fence up. Fence up. Jet suck. Jet suck. Fence up. Fence up. We're on this Friday. F I N S up uh, up uh, up. Uh. They like J E T S suck suck suck. F I N S up uh, up Hey, uh, I done been uh. around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and I'm still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still suck. Sit up big trees and I'm just still suck. They get uh. top three picks and I'm just still suck. And even when we die, and the fence still up. Yeah, it's your boy Stephen so D, low, and so you low, already so know low, I got the so flow low, going so up low, to New so York. Low, oh, New yeah. York! I just got some bars for y'all. Y'all just got some, that was free. I gave that to y'all for free. Y'all, y'all won't ready. Y'all won't ready. Y'all won't ready. I'm having a good time. Look, guys, uh, I'm heading up to New York. Make sure tomorrow you guys check everything out tomorrow. From 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. right here, the MetLife Takeover at Slattery's Midtown Pub. If you're not able to be there, I'll be there live. Should be a lot of cool people in the building, and I should be able to get a lot of really, really cool interviews. So uh, it'll be a lot of fun. Um, so look, man, just make sure y'all support, watch the channel, support the channel by helping it grow. Um, there's a lot of cool things that we're doing. So please share this video today. And uh, yeah, man, I just want to make sure y'all are... Uh, in tune. Even if you're not there, I want you all to be there. That's what I do, man. I bring the party to you uh, in the palm of your hand or in your house, on your TV, whatever it may be. That's that's my job. So hope you all enjoy that. And then obviously Sunday, Sunday, the Tail Greeter pregame show hosted by yours truly will be live from 10 a.m. to noon Eastern Standard Time, live from the MetLife Takeover at MetLife Stadium. It's going to be a lot of fun there. Uh, so make sure y'all are doing that. It's going to be a lot of fun. Um, so make sure y'all are uh, watching 10 a.m. to noon on Sunday and then tomorrow, 7 p.m. to 9. Hey, if you're going to be there tomorrow, there are rules uh, in New York City um, and uh, New York City law for indoor events. OK, so I just want to let you all know 
Uh, you have to show proof of vaccination for the, the bar in New York on the Saturday night event. You do not need to do that for the game on Sunday. I repeat, you do not need to do that for the game on Sunday. This is only for Saturday night in New York City. Uh, so just make sure y'all are aware of that. And also, man, support the channel. Let's go. We've got a lot of cool things coming up. I'm glad y'all liked the show today. It was a lot of fun. I enjoyed hanging out with y'all and doing it. Y'all the best fans in the world. Just know that. And uh, it's been a lot of fun. So this is Clack Blackers, Miami fans, number one morning show with your boy, Stephen D, doing it every day, Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. till, I don't know, 10, 1030. Depends on when we get off the air. But just to let you all know, this is the number one Miami fan morning show. I love you all. Hope you all having a lot of fun. And, guys, this is the number one podcast network, Miami Sports Music Podcast Network, a network made by the fans for the fans. Follow us on social media at Miami Sports Music. If you're on Twitter, it's at MIA Sports Music. So make sure you're doing that. And, you know, you guys can always follow me. You can always follow me. Follow me at Stephen D. SKPL. Spread kindness, positivity, and love. And uh, I forgot to do this. Today is Spread Kindness Friday. So let me just kind of leave you all with this. Every Spread Kindness Friday, I try to do this. There are a lot of people that go through a lot of different things. Ups, downs, doesn't matter. Um, Y'all, you have to understand, you never know what somebody's going through. And just because things are going well, or you might think things are going well, maybe they, they, on their Instagram, they think that, you know, they're looking like they're, they're up and down the East Coast. I have my moments. Don't get me wrong. And, and, And life can be tough sometimes. And everybody has something. Text somebody. Even if they don't text back, just reach out to somebody. You never know what somebody's going through. And just understand that by reaching out to somebody and asking them how their day's going, you never know how they're feeling. They might be the loneliest people in the world right there, right there in that moment. They just might feel that way. Even if they have a million friends, they might feel that way. And you reaching out to them, letting them know, asking them how their day's going might mean the world. So just know that. Okay. Um, so just understand spread kindness is about reaching out to your your fellow Finns fans, your family, your friends, whatever they are. You never know what somebody's going through. And just asking a question can save somebody's life. I really mean that. Just asking the question about how the other day is going can save somebody's life. So spread kindness, y'all. I love y'all. Y'all the best fans in the world. I'll see y'all tomorrow at 7 p.m. right here on the Miami Sports Music Podcast Network. Let's go. Play it one more time for y'all. New York. <laughs> I'm back. Hey, I done been around the world and I just this up. Sit up big dreams and I just this up. They get top three picks and I just this up. And even when we die, and the fist still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I just this up. Sit up big dreams and I just this up. They get top three picks and I just this up. And even when we die, and the fist still up. <laughs> I had to take a break, was on a high eight. My team been doing bad, but they still my favorite. But when I'm Jets on the schedule, then the fouls flavor. Five fingers to your face, I'm like, hi, hater. Hey, plus my squad, they been missing me. DWA, we stick together through the misery. When I play go out to New York, do you remember me? The one that love to spell your name and always hit your team. J-E-T-S, sup, sup, sup. F- I N S uh 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 When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet man like your fans, hush, hush, hush. J E T S up, up, up. F I N S uh 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 When we see your defense, we gon' rush, rush, rush. And when we yet man like your fans, hush, hush. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. Sit up big dreams and I'm just this up. They get top three picks and I'm just this up. And even when we die, and the fence still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just this up. Sit up big dreams and I'm just this up. They get top three picks. And the chest still suck. And even when we die, and the fence still up. Jet suck, jet, the jet suck. Fence up, fence up. Jet suck, jet, the jet suck. Fence up, fence up. We like J E T E. F I N S. They like J E T E. F I N S. 
Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still up. City of big dreams and I'm just still up. They get top three picks and I'm just still up. And even when we die, and I'm been still up. Hey, I done been around the world and I'm just still up. City of big dreams and I'm just still up. They get top three picks and I'm just still up. And even when we die, and I'm been still up. Who that? So low, so low, so low, deep. So low, so low, so low, deep. New York. New York.